anyway. Do you often get and commissions for overlays besides the the, the, the races and all that? Mm, not really. The last commission I had was yours. And I learned a lot from the uh, fuck up of not showing you the whips. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I'm just, I'm adamant for communication, so. Yeah. Um, no, I think you should put your work out there for like overlay specifically. I mean, you do it at the, you do what you want at the end of the day, but you do some fantastic overlays. I think Thank there's you. money in that. Yeah, it probably is. And right now I'm trying to do like the back, so I'm having to figure out how to do the distortion stuff. Yeah. It's like, I've got the whole void, dark red to black, that's easy. Order, done. It's just getting that distortion effect with the um, wavy yellow and red lines. The little things. That's gonna be fun. Hey everybody, we're live. Yeah, we're just letting You're the right. stream warp a bit. Much like how you turn the ignition on in the car, and they just let, it, let that baby purr for a bit before we drive in that uh, dreadful blizzard. Although it's not any... We're close to a blizzard today, it's 90 plus degrees outside. Or you're trying to get some sleep and you hear what you are convinced is someone leaving an engine on, and then you look outside for ages and you can't hear or see anything. <laughs> and then you realize, oh wait, it's a weird audio phenomenon known as the hum. The hum sounds like a bad guy, some sort of science uh, fiction story. I mean, it might be, because no one knows what the fuck it is. It just comes and goes in different places around the world. The hum. I mean, I've heard it a few times in the past. I've heard a lot of humming in my life, but I can't. I never associate it with some sort of weird phenomenon. Now, it's speculated it's like near low frequency noises coming from some subterranean ground activity. Ah, uh, mole men. I was thinking more like underground cables, wind farms at sea, that type of thing. Yeah, it's not nearly as exciting. I like mole nah. men. I mean, there's no hollow earth as far as we're aware. <laughs> that we know, yeah. Hey, Ali, how's it going? You as well, uh, JSK. Hey, Ryan, how's it going? Hey, Jason. Santiago? Ali? War Monster? No, not War Monster. War Monster's terrifying. Moment are funny. All right. We're going to get going here in a moment. I hope everyone's been enjoying their Wednesday as much as you can enjoy it. It's hump day, you know? Getting over the hump. I've been, I've been yawning my ass off the entire day. And like I'm, I'm hoping like the, the stream will uh, wake me up in some capacity, and then I won't be able to go back to sleep, and I'll be wired, and I won't be able to sleep. All right, let's uh, switch over to the main feed here, and let's get the likely final session of Metroid Prime done tonight, because we're going to be doing phase on mines, hopefully in all one fell swoop, because of our sequence break in the last session. And then we're gonna do some cleanup, and then we're going to head back to the impact crater. Let me get the chat. Where's my chat at? There it is. Let me pop that out. Put that right next to me so I can see it a little easier. I don't have to turn my head so far. Hey, Mr. Paul, how's it going, man? I'm doing just fine. Thank you for asking. Hey, uh, Betty Shrubber, yeah. thank you for the tier one. Much appreciate it. All right. Hmm. Uh, let's go back to the Metro Fusion connection bonuses because you have to re-enable this every single time. Yup. Kind of annoying, yeah. but whatever. I, I don't know why it's not a saved flag, but... Did Trilogy fix that, or do you still have to? I think you might still have to, but then Trilogy is like... Ugh, trying yeah. to get all that unlocked required, we connect 24. Hey, uh, the bone Father, thank you for the gift bomb. Much appreciate it, man. Was that at five subs? Yeah, it's five subs. Yeah, we're finishing. We are like we're finishing Brown today. It's very like we're finishing Brown today. Hey. Hey, Jason. How's it going, man? Hey, I'm uh, pretty good. Awesome. Just vibing. That's not heard about Metroid Moment. Primes. What was that? I heard about Moment. Moment? Yeah, yeah. We're talking. Uh, Experiment was talking about uh, the phenomenon known as the hum. Uh, is it, it, it's that unexplained noise you probably hear at night sometimes, which we, he, he figures it just, it just probably just amounts to like underground activity, like electric cables or some other shit. I like to think of it as mole men because that's just more funny or funnier, I guess. Uh, don't uh, forget to use yeah. the mega turret. Yeah, I was gonna say, you know, I was looking for those as early as the space pirate HQ. I was like, what is the area that introduces the mega turrets? And it's like, oh, it's, it's the phase on mines. And would you believe that this room has the um, access point to early grapple beam as well? <laughs> 
Oh, it's Let's get rid of these guys. It's really easy as well. We, um, I thought you might have had to scan dash off the magnetic rail there. As it happens, no, there's a scan right next to where you can just use an abuse for free. Oh, awesome. Well, let's get this door open first. Yep, yep. Hello. Hey, Fonz, Hello. how's it going? Pretty all right. Had a fun time. How's your new controllers? Uh... <laughs> Oh, well, you got your uh, you got your new COVID jab today, right? Uh, no, I was just getting tested. I already had the vaccine. Oh, okay. That's why I said he plays more. a dangerous game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Look, so where am I scan dashing off of? Uh, you need to get as high up as you can on top of that little um where the control is. There's like a little metal platform right next to it. I see. All right, let me build these guys real quick. Where the hell is this asshole? I saw you shooting at me. Eh, 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 eh. He's down. Eh. Uh, speaking of assholes, there was an anti-vaxxer where I was uh, oh getting tested god. at, yelling were they at people. Protesting? Oh my god! They were just yelling at people. They uh, it, it, it got really bad. The cops were in the area. <laughs> yeah, what are you gonna do? Uh, Battle of America. Oh. Well, I mean, I mean, I mean, that is their right, but it's also like you also have the right to just not pay attention. <laughs> I mean, my general answer to that is, um, hey, yo, I appreciate your input, but please, fuck off. I don't give a fuck. You're in the I way, I'm trying to get this, Arby's. So now that we're on this metal platform here, if you go to the side closest towards the opposite end there, where the um, crane's hanging out yeah. with the grapple point, if you get near that corner, you should be able to see a scan point for the magnetic rail and another one right next to it. Can you see what we're going to do here? All right, so we're going to the, scan there's dash. There's the grapple point here. Yep, so we need to look right from there. Right from here. Yep, and as you scroll down towards uh, the magnetic rail, you'll oh, see... This Little panel. The one on the right. Yep, yeah. that panel on the right. We're going to use that to scan dash straight over to the other side. To this room over there. Yep. Okay. Because normally you're supposed to go in from there after the grapple beam. This is 1.0. That's a very nice suggestion that was to do that normally. Okay, so we'll make a save state here just in case. Yep, that's fair. All right. We'll just uh, use that one that hasn't been scanned to the right and yeah. uh, best of All luck. Right. Count how many times it takes us to do this, but uh, well, let's make sure that we're actually positioned pretty well here. I think we're close I mean, to the, I think, yeah, I think we're about as far as we can get here. You're pretty, yeah, you've pretty good position. This one's yeah. a nice, easy one compared to the twin fires. Uh, well, that was a good first attempt. Ooh, almost. How far am I to? Oh, yeah. There we go. Man, these controllers are absolutely like cooked. There's no battery in both of them. I mean, that's a safer thing, I'd say. I'd rather have no batteries than Maybe a controller and have to deal with the racist old man. There we go. You know what else is... <laughs> there you go. Nicely done. Awesome. Hi, Trav. Hey. Hey, hey Trav. Fuck you. <laughs> Trav, what do we talk about? I'm sorry, Dad! <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> so now we just go through that little morph ball tunnel and climb up to the top. Hey, uh, Surgeon Dragon, thank you very much for the Twitch Prime. Uh, you just... You as well, Curtis DX. You're gonna want to save state before you open the door at the top of here because there's an enemy right outside it and he's just vibing, you know, he's chilling, he ain't gonna bother you. He won't attack you at all unless you attack him. Oh, I see. But why save state it's specifically? A, um, because we're going to do a final scan dash and we're gonna use that enemy to skip over the last gap oh. straight to the grapple beam door. After but that, do, do you want me to save state here or do you want me to save state the other way? Keep going. I mean, oh, like going. the proper door, it'll oh, be the ice beam. Door. Okay, okay. Yeah, Samus has hand cramps to hold in the cannon. I mean, we, talk, we talked about this last night. Like, if you leave her idle for too long, uh, she will just lower the gun eventually. And it, it, you get, you get kind of like a scenic mode where you just take a look at the environment. Okay, right, cool. So let's let's now is the time here. to save state. All right. Scan dashing off an enemy. I don't normally do that, but whatever. It's first time. Again, this playthrough is very much first time for everything. So. I mean, worst case, we'll just have to do the puzzle in that room. And because we've got power bombs... <laughs> Is it's it this guy? <laughs> yep. He, well, hey, he won't buddy. attack you at all. You can even walk right past him. He won't care. Really? <laughs> as long as you don't shoot him, he'll just stand there and vibe. <laughs> yeah, mate. Don't mind us. We're just going to scan their shot of you. Hey, purple guy. Oh, hey, Simon. How you doing? Yeah, nothing. They don't pay me enough for this shit. <laughs> I know chilling. you'll kill me. You glad? Absolutely. All right. So where are we scan dashing to? Um, again, just onto the other side of that platform there. 
Oh, where the so grapple your... beam is at. Okay, I see. Yep. Over there. So we've got to use this gap here. This one can be slightly tight, but I think you'll. I reckon you'll get it. If yeah. you can't try this side, try the other one. We can save state here. Yep. They can't right. attack you unless you attack them. That's so because we 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 didn't pass the trigger point. Is that what it is? No, it's because the trigger point is all the way down on the bottom floor. If you shoot them, that wakes it up anyway. But since we're past that point, they're not going to care. They're off the clock. How do you do, yeah. fellow Samus? Ooh. How do you do, fellow cum stops? <laughs> Ooh, uh, <laughs> Just call me a cum sock? Yeah. Oh, yes. That was a lot of time. The... Come on. That, there's a lot to unpack in that. Ooh. Oh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh. damn it. That Did was nearly. That? Oh, yeah, I saw that for I a think few the game frames. Froze. Oh, boy. Yeah. Yeah, that can happen sometimes with save states. Ooh, but it should that. be fine with the reloads. Buzzing. So have we rescued the last Metroid yet? Uh, so I got um uh, experiment when I loaded the state, it gave me some sort of uh, window error, uh, and it let the game say? continue uh, from from beforehand. But now it's like causing. Okay, now it seems to be fine. Yeah, it says. Please although there seems to be some back. aliasing going on now with the screen. I have no idea what's going on there. Is it just in the scan visor? Uh, it was going. It was doing that with the scan visor at first. Ooh, look at that! I actually want to keep doing this to see where it goes. Oh, oh hello. Goodness. That is untextured. Okay, that's interesting. Interesting. Do it again. Yeah, it's like Here I want to see. see. This I one's was... space pirate is just like on his break, and it's just like Samus is over here just breaking the games. He's like, yep, now they five o'clock for me. See, if I was <laughs> able to, um, it seems I'm able to avoid it if I immediately switch to X ray, so it has something to do with Scan Visor. Maybe. Maybe it's hello, because you did it on the. Uh, so if we can't get it on this side, we can try the other side. That might be a more easier angle. But when yeah. I did the test, I did it from this side. You did it from this side? Oh, you mean from the other side there. Okay, there. Dolphin just straight up crashed. <laughs> I was yeah, waiting. I was, wa I was waiting for that. I was waiting for that. I'm, so <laughs> yeah, I'm honestly it surprised to it took that long. Happened to me during test and just reboot, reload, and it should be okay. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Yeah, what is that? Worst, worst case, we can't get this scan dash. We just do the puzzle here normally. Yeah, Next here we go. We come from, uh, the same thing just popped up here. Uh, I just I just like to hit that ignore button. You know, it's a GameCube game. What's it going to do? Complain to Nintendo. What's it gonna... So, experiment. What the fuck is happening here on a technical level? Uh, we seem to have safe stated on the perfect frame when it's trying to do EFB access. And um, GameCube games not likey when you're trying to fuck with CPU and GPU timings at once. Why is everyone blaming me for this in the chat? I have nothing to do with this. I heard it. Nora, in the chat, what will she break? What? It what? might be a smart idea to make sure you have a scan visor and try another serm. Uh, yeah, that's probably for the best. Just. Let me, my uh. Thought is, yeah, let me see. Why is he chilling there? Because we, because we, we, didn't, the we didn't go past trigger point, yeah. Uh, so it's like that one, uh, that one elite in Halo One. So you said you yeah, oh. corridor. <laughs> like you try to. I'd say just <laughs> you try, yeah, try the opposite side. I reckon that might be easier for you because you'll have more wiggle room and the angle might be better. Okay, sure. This is the most helpful pirate you've ever seen in any Metroid game. Uh, he's gonna help us break the game. It's so generous of him. I wish his friends in Fenjana would do that. <laughs> nah. But no, Mister God, I have us go through the whole thing. Nah. Oh wait, I we already the, did that one. It's like I hit the pillar. It almost bonk. Yeah, suddenly this is a lot more stable. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's just, it's weird. It has something to do with the scan visor. It's interesting. It's just how it works. Uh, just watching you do this one just reminds me of SpongeBob skit. First, you do this. <laughs> Spin around. Stop. <laughs> Spin around. Stop. Double takes three times. Yeah. One, two, three. Ow. <laughs> Did you pelvic thrust? <laughs> Woo! -hoo! Dang, I was hoping you'd do it at the time. <laughs> oh, wait. Hold on. You know what I'm doing wrong? Hold on. Um. Yeah, use a grapple beam. No. <laughs> well, Secret breaking it. dipshit. <laughs> yeah, by the way, last night after the stream, I started yeah. playing a little bit of 30XX, and yeah. there is a grapple beam in that game, and it's really, really fun. Yeah. You can Wait, just uh, pull yourself to enemies. Yo, that sounds sweet. Oh, and like, so Goomba jump yeah. off of them. It's really Dude, fun. Grapple hooks that take you to the enemy have become like my favorite thing. <laughs> Oh yeah, I mean it's basically the meat hook. <laughs> Damn right. 
Because that was one of the best parts of fucking... Just... No, I'm going to get this. Just... Oh, he's determined now. Yeah. Uh, right, that I was, was determined for early. I was determined for early plasma. I'm going to get this. Uh, now I'm motivated. Now I'm motivated. It, it just takes one little taste and then they're addicted. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm serious. Oh, almost. Uh, what am I missing? Like, I keep going. Uh, I'm hitting too far right because I'm hitting here. I'm hitting here. Mm -hmm. I should be aiming here. It's like maybe you need to just do it one, like break out immediately and try to reorientate yourself so you know where you are. Yeah. I'm waiting for that there? moment where you accidentally shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> kind of impossible with the scan uh, visor, but that'd be some shit if I could. You just shoot like encrypted data at him. He's like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> what? Could, new cookie policy. Get out of here. He just sees in his mind the <laughs> fucking uh, the Navy fuck? Seal copy pasta. Oh, what, what the fuck you say about me, little bitch? Also, I remember having my, that in oh, fourteen. All right, geez. okay. My bad. Um, <laughs> Trav. <laughs> hmm. Your aggressive sense of humor doesn't work with everybody. <laughs> I'm just going to say that right now, so people can take that the wrong way. No, that's fair. All right, I I'm sorry, Chad. I love you. Not I Chad. Wonder an... I wonder yeah. if an L jump might make that gap. It's an L jump. Oh, you mean like a on the over there? I mean, Ghetto jump. Mm. could I stand like on that? Maybe. Uh, it's 1.0. If you could stand on that, that'd be... Well, let's try a basic L jump first. I don't think that's going to work. Otherwise, why the hell would they bother giving it to you? But we can try. Yeah. It's worth... I go at least. Now, yeah. if the L button would kindly recognize it, no. Hold on a second. Let's try. No, I'm just missing it. Like, you just, like, lay on top of that thing and just jump That's what I'm there. trying to do. Yeah, that's there we go. Wow, it. I really overthought that. Oh, wow. Yeah, there you go. Happy days. Let's go. Right. <laughs> Yay! 1.0 is a magical thing. Ooh, grapple beam. There's the nice. grapple hook. <laughs> Guess people just like to scan dash off that enemy because it's quicker if you know what you're doing. Oh, cool. We may not have to do the puzzle of shame. <laughs> That's Yay! what I call it anyway. All right. So from here now, just drop down to level two of this room and the ice beam door to the bottom level. We'll come back to the top level in a moment. Look. I love this game so much, I want to play as little of it as possible. <laughs> and the safe thing is, you're already right. And yeah, we can scan him. He will yeah, not do anything. Yeah, we do anything. Alright, so when we get to the second floor... Yeah, again, there's the door right there. I have experiment on my GPS for today because he's the one telling me about all these sequence breaks, and I'm way off my fucking normal course. <laughs> so, I, I'm kind of like flabbergasted, like, oh man, the possibilities are endless. Oh yeah. I just don't think it's straight down there. Um, I am a little sad though because normally uh, I have Wave Buster at this point, and I love using that on the drone. But you know, whatever. It's a. Uh... Oh, you mean the drone in the power bomb room? Yeah, that we're gonna use a power bomb to take out. Oh, I've got, I've got something special there for you. When oh, we get okay. to that enemy, use the X-ray visor. Really? Oh, because you, you can see him. That's right, because we're not supposed to have X-ray visor. You can see him, and you can also see something you're not usually supposed to see. He has a unique shield on him. Really? Okay. Oh my god, it's a penis. <laughs> uh, let me think. This next room, this expansion in the vents. Have fun. Oh yeah, here. I love this room because you do this. That's oh of... yeah. I love that. I love it. <laughs> god! Fuck! <laughs> All right, I, we got this. I really oh. wish there were more moments like that. Uh, agreed, she's got, agreed. She's got no idea we're here. We got this. Wait, what's that? Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Why is it getting so hot in here? Why do you do this? Whoa. What was that from? That was from 14. I... Oh, shit. Uh, what part of 14? Uh, that's Suzaku. Oh, right. I oh, yeah, where she's there. crying the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I didn't take my... I got quotes okay. from... I got... Uh, so this, like, legit, I isolated quotes from all of the four lords. Well, not Genbu, because he doesn't talk. But I only took one from Suzaku, because everything else is literally just, please fuck me. <laughs> please fuck me so much. I wanted you to fuck <laughs> me so much. It's like, uh, oh, I, so I'm rough. mad. No, just Pick no. it right in my cloaca. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh my God. You, you said that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we need to scan this pirate lore. Yep, there's a lot of it in this room. Yeah. So remember, kids, don't fall in love with. Uh, don't Google pirate. cloaca. 
<laughs> oh boy, here I go. <laughs> Oh no, what's it's this, supposed to be a what's really this photo of a snake doing here. Scary enemy, haha, <laughs> super missiles say hi. Let's, super uh, missiles go Actually, far. get those super missiles. <laughs> oh! Lower your hand. Alright. No. <laughs> put your hands down. Okay. Everybody in the club, put your hands down. <laughs> Please, I can't <laughs> see the DJ. <laughs> Does he only takes two super missiles? Yep. Yes. Because he's not the big this, boy. This oh, is the okay. worst experience experience of my life. I'm five ten in the six two club. God, these pays on intervals ain't shit. <laughs> six foot versus five thirteen. <laughs> what is that? Feel like? I'm oh, personally yeah, of the five thirteen. All right, these oh hey, it's here. the it's the easiest one of these up little troopers. I mean, they're, the they're not ones. right either. There we go. The ice Thank ones, yeah. Much. Oh my god, yeah, the ice ones really got the short end of the cock. <laughs> Especially when they're flying. <laughs> Wait, hang on. What is the short end of the cock? The balls. I was gonna say the pubic hair, but no, if I feel like, because those things are long. Okay. Wait, was that a power trooper that I scanned out there, or was that an ice trooper? Ice. Oh, no, so... it was ice. It was ice. Also, um, I'm on my shitty headset microphone because my stay, uh, desktop one is. Yeah, because Fawn took your rock band mic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you finally boosted up the old Xbox 360 microphone. We're proud of you. Fuck Disappointed yeah, I did. in you. Proud all the same. All right, Trav, now say a bunch of bad things. Poopy ass diarrhea. Like, what were they thinking? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking pay me! Yeah, all the important scans are red in Metroid Prime. Yep. Oh, the orange ones aren't required. No, they're just uh, they're just oh, flavor text. Yep. Orange is fluff. Red's what you want. Oh wait, has Johnny read the uh, best uh, best one? Which one? Series? You have scanned it at this point. Uh, the well, whole like engineering morph ball technology. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. In this room. <laughs> Four pirates. Actually, uh, let me see. Wait, I think it might be in this room. It is. I think it's in one That's of the, the level ones. Uh, care sergeant, it, time for a second. Oh, no, those are the uh, those are about the artifacts. Thank God, no. All right, well, actually, we need to okay because if, if you never play Metroid Prime, you have to uh, you have to experience this uh, look. It's one of the best games in the game. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, I, I just wisely decided to move on. Yeah, let me see. Here. <laughs> I think it's one of these lower ones. Uh, that Metroid Prime. Prince of Even though they shouldn't have access at this point, plus holes of money. I do love this one because that one was like, "Hey, Samus is here." Uh, red alert. <laughs> I think it might be an orange one, Sever. Right oh God! Oh fuck! No, it's a, it's a, it's a. Um, I think it's, it's a red. Yeah, here we yeah. go. Science team is attempting to reverse engineer Samus, uh, Samus Aran's arsenal based off the data acquired from her assault on our forces. Progress is slow but steady. Command would dearly enjoy turning Aran's weapons against her. We believe we can implement beam weapon prototypes in three cycles. Aran's power technology remains a mystery, especially the curious morph ball function. All attempts at ending, all attempts at duplicating it have ended in disaster. Four test set, four test subjects were horribly broken and twisted when they engaged our morph ball prototypes. Science team has wisely decided to move on. After that. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. All right. I love how it basically took them four tries to be like, all right, we're moving on. Yeah, uh, it gets nope. uh, prime two and three are the best ones, though. If your first you don't succeed, try it again. If it doesn't again, uh, one more time. Yeah. Third time? Ah, uh, uh, shit. Okay, Fourth? Okay, let's do <laughs> okay. right. Fine. What's that? The one hunter? Fucking two hunters, surely we are cursed. <laughs> Man, I cannot wait for Metroid Dread where there's gonna be a freaking space pirate that's just basically a ball. He's just gonna be like, yeah, I'm just here. <laughs> we have power bombs now, we have, we can see, yeah, because we have power bombs, we can do this now. Are space pirates even around post super? No, uh, no we they're kinda, not. We kind of made them extinct. Like, uh, do we count the X parasites? Yeah, the, the ones we see in Fusion are X parasites. I don't, I personally uh, don't count that. Uh, they can. They're clones. Fuck Anyone it. need a GPU right now? Maybe I don't need a why. GPU, no. Uh, there's a 3090 going below MSRP. Where? On oh. Amazon. Oh, oh, send me a link. What's the GPU? And then everyone is chat once to it. 3090? Ooh. And then yeah. suddenly John already had three viewers. Yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> why did John go offline? <laughs> yeah, I'm about to say, post it. 
Oh, but why is Metroid Prime suddenly got RTX shading? <laughs> Much. How much oh, was it? Nope, that's too much it's for me. It's 1431, which is 60 below MSRP. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just 60 below. Which I, I, I suppose well, technically is a deal, up. sure. But. Uh, well, uh, you know, you have to consider if you try to buy it off eBay, it's going to be three grand. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's definitely a good deal, but I do not have that kind of money right now. Should be some Ooh. raid and power being troopers in there. Power beam is below. I normally like to nuke him with the super missile, but I'm going to scan one first because I, I think it's the only. Uh, no, I haven't uh, scanned plasma. Yeah, plasma won't show up until the lowest floor. So, I, I said, once we've got the power bombs from here, we can then go and clean the surface level up in one swing and then just come straight back down here, down to the third level, clear out the Omega Pirate area, leave yeah. by a Magma. This, this, this is the mission station, This is the mission station, right? Uh, the final map station. Yeah. Oh, is it yeah, a map station? You're lucky to get a GPO that, that's 20% close to MSRP. Like, come on. <laughs> Oh yeah, speaking of selling stuff at a low price, I am finally selling my Amiibos. Oh, uh, what made you want to uh, bite the bullet on that, finally? Uh, just looked at my room and I just see all my Amiibos kind of cluttered up in one spot. And I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and just try to sell these I, I right now. I feel on that because I still have not unpacked my Amiibos since moving. <laughs> like he's like, you know what I actually need? Actual anime fans. <laughs> Listen. I, I, you want... say that as I look towards my Link statue, my Mewtwo statue, yeah. and a bunch of other statues. <laughs> Listen, I understand because all, oh, yeah, all that you would want amiibos for, there are people on Etsy making illegal amiibos for you. And they take up <laughs> like a fraction of the space. Yeah. I know. What? Amiibo cards are so nice and easy to manufacture. I think you're saving on space and environmental materials. Yeah. It's the best of all worlds. <laughs> it really is. Illegal amiibos. That's a name I didn't expect to hear. Today. Amiib, no. You're not allowed to have that. Patented. Just... <laughs> they can't Nintendo... stop me. Not until well, Nintendo... I take my well, legal Nintendo box. shouldn't have invented the cards that only used them once on a terrible Animal Crossing game on the Wii U. We don't but talk about that game. This is, the, this is the same company that gave us an SD card adapter for Animal Crossing on the That's GameCube, and then we just cloned it to have our own SD card adapter for ISOs. Whoops. It always goes back to Animal Crossing. It's just like, all right, we made some Animal Crossing stuff, and our systems are hacked. God fucking damn it. <laughs> Wait, dude. The GameCube SD adapter thing was official? Yep, it was. And, oh, uh, yeah, we just sort of, because they wanted the idea, oh, you could take photos and take them with you outside of or into the game in Japan only. And uh, we cloned it and made the SD Gecko. I mean, it makes sense. And then on the Wii, they gave us SD and USB ports, but they were only 1.0. Then they were stupid and gave us U iOS 58, which gave us USB 2 support. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Okay. Uh, let's... Oh, we're in the room. Oh, fuck this room. <laughs> no, well, well, we have x-ray advisor, so this should be... Yeah. I, we can't scan this thing, can we? Nope, it's no. just a normal... Um, yeah, it's just thing. invisible. For some fucking reason. They never do this again. I would so, have yeah. loved to have seen this thing's original purpose. Like, Oh yeah, look at I that. Feel like, it has a force. I feel like this fucker was supposed to appear more often. How the hell are you supposed to fight this thing? Originally, just shoot at it? You just, you, yeah, you just, you're just shooting at it wildly. Uh, unless you have Waybuster. If you if you explore enough yeah. to do Waybuster, then it makes it an, a joke. God, I died here. I did too, right. first time. Because I wasn't sure what to do. Let's Someone was saving me in the back of the number. Okay, this one out of 16. Not bad, not bad. Could God. Be do you, we, uh, did I already scan this? Yeah, I did. Awesome. Are there any more lore? You telling me that like my aggressive sense of humor wouldn't translate to the chat? Uh, Not chat, Fonz. <laughs> oh, oh, hold on. You were just being rude for a second. That's why I called oh, you no. out on it. <laughs> I was, I was rude to Fonz because I am rude to him all the time. Okay, I wasn't sure. Like, I'll buy, uh, no, uh, hey, look. In I your circle, your in your circle, that's normal. I don't know. I didn't know that, so I, no, I it's took okay. it in a defensive way. Okay, I thought it was about chat, and I was about to bring no. up a story. Um, okay, then fuck you, chat. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> and also, Fonz, just in case, I am sorry. Um, Don't worry, Trev, it's alright. I know how you are. But, uh, <laughs> I know you can't help being an asshole. Um, alright, but I'm gonna tell my story anyway, under the impression that it was about chat. Um, I had a friend who basically did that exact same thing and I had to get after him and I'm realizing I didn't learn from it. Literally every time, every time someone new would join my Discord server, he would just say, fuck you. 
And it's like, he, um, and he, that was just his way of greeting people, and I got after him for it, and then he's like, here's a compromise, and he renamed himself in the server to he who says fuck you. And uh, I didn't get any complaints after that. <laughs> okay, cool. Now that we have the OG power bombs, you can go and clean up the surface level if you want to do that now, or we can continue going straight down. We have I to guess. go back up there anyway, don't we? Oh no, because yeah. we um no 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 uh, yeah we we have to go back up there anyway. So let's just keep going down. Oh, well, let's go to well, the save room actually. I need to recharge. The way Wait, this um, is right now is we only need to go back to the surface level to get a few expansions, the flamethrower, the elite phase on, and its artifacts, and we can all do that now in one loop. Then after that, we can come straight down here. So what would you recommend? Um. Because if we were to go via, <laughs> if we were to escape via the surface level, we could go straight to Chozo Ruins, but that would be more backtracking to Frandrana. Yeah. So, or we can go through the surface loop and leave via Magmore instead, which means we're right next to Frandrana Edge. We can get the bits we missed there, go straight back down to Magmore into Chozo, and then to Talon Overworld. But when do we get drinks? You just, it's, well, it's, BY, it's BYOB. Okay. <sighs> The choice is yours. And chat, if you need assistance with getting onto the uh, the Discord server, just hit me up on either Discord or Twitter. Yo, can I hit you is up on Cash App? What? <laughs> Yo, what's your grinder? <laughs> oh, here, I'll get it for you. One second. <laughs> My grinder? Yeah, sure. Um, it might be a bit loud, so you'll have to pardon the moment. You <laughs> realize it just turns on a food processor. Uh, JJ said before, Metro Prime, uh, Metro Prime 2's uh, Morph Ball death animation is really fucking cheap looking. I hate it. Wait, what is it? You, you just fall apart like Legos. Wait, what? <laughs> I've never seen that. Yeah, if you die in Morph Ball mode in Metro Prime 2, the thing just falls apart like one of those goddamn orange wrap, like orange, orange, uh, chocolate oranges. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> that like Samus wrap. becomes an orange. Yeah. <laughs> oh. No, I wish now, I had a fucking orange. Now we could shoot those things, but you know what? Oh, that's not fun enough. Let's torture them instead. I think, Time to ruin I think the it's been a while since I've died today. in. Pr I, I, it's been a while since I died in warp bomb mode in Prime One. I think it's just a nuclear explosion, though. Yeah, you just yeah. explode. You just explode like a power bomb, and then it just. Be, be, be. What the fuck, Crash? <laughs> I remember as a kid, Samus's like yell when she dies freaked me out. Oh yeah. Or it's like, ah, or something like that. It is uh, not like, ah. Uh, uh, well, I don't want to scream right now. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Link, you don't want to go Super Saiyan? Uh, no, I, I did that last week enough. I don't want to do any more screaming. I no, lo I no longer want to be angry. I just want to be happy. Uh, 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 let's see, this room, missile expansion. Yeah, Quite that's in the. You have, to, you have the power bomb wall. Yep. Near the uh, magnetic rail. And in this room, you can oh, do a series oh, of somewhat oh, complicated oh, jumps to oh, skip. Oh, oh, that's dangerous. Oh, I, oh. Oh God! Feel that face on John? Does it feel good? No, not yet. Mm. John, you're too, game too early. Uh -huh. It's the forbidden soup. <laughs> Either way, could you stand closer? I want to make some toast. Samus just catches on like phase on fire or something like that. Or would it be would it be phase fire on or fire? Phase on fire? <laughs> Remember Samus, think... you can drink the phase on, but only once. I think it would just be radiation burns. Yeah. Right. Inject it into my bloodstream. Inject that shit into my veins. Welcome to Chernobyl Simulator. Oh. <laughs> what are we injecting into our veins? What? Phase on. Uh, uh, congratulations, Pat. We're going to oh, that, go that good shoe. <laughs> yeah, okay. absolutely. I'm just stand on this. Want, oh, I can't stand on this. No, no. Right. What am I standing on? Did I hit the what platform? Am I fighting for? I yeah, think you I, I landed on the platform. <laughs> oh, shit. More of the platforms! I wish I'd bring back that. But oh well. I wish that they would just like give us a target breaker maker for Smash if they oh, yeah. had their own shit. I agree. Break the targets. Yeah, I miss that. I miss targets. This yeah, face on tastes like Baja Blast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I actually never been to a target. But no, I lied. I've been to one target, but it was in Philadelphia. Oh, the uh, the TMG target. Yeah. yeah. It, took, it, it, it took you to Philadelphia to go to a target, really. I, there is. 
I live in the bum fucking middle of nowhere. Hey, shit here! <laughs> Look, listen, you're not missing much. It's too white. There's no, there's no next concession. I live in the middle of nowhere and I still have a target driving distance. <laughs> I'm about to say, in my driving distance, the only thing like far enough is a Best Buy and a Walmart. And that's Look it. the one place you buy your grocery shopping. You have a Best Buy but not a Target? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I, I'm surprised about that too. There is no Target here. Uh, there is a Best Buy. They're usually like right across the street from each other. <laughs> I I still get sad that my be uh, the Best Buy near me was one of the casualties throughout 2020 of like places Aww. that closed down. That's now the uh, now the closest one is about like a forty minute drive to one. So, uh, apparently the Michaels near our place is closing down, which sucks because like I don't want to go to Hobby Lobby for craft shit if I can help it. They they sure do steal antiquities. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what's a Michaels? Uh, it's it's, it's a craft store. A stamp. That's exactly yeah, why they're know. shutting down. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not because of COVID, it's just because their name was just regular. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Basic ass. Hey, let's go Michaels. to Michael's. They all just like go to Michael's place. Like, uh, who are you people? <laughs> no, that yeah. like War of the Bets. Now it's War of the Michaels. I used to do a lot of arts and crafts, and even then I would never go to Michael's. Yeah, I'm not hey, a fan not. of that band name. Uh, there was a place called AC Moore. I want to go to Michael's either. I don't like Birdman attacking me. <laughs> I don't know why, but I thought you said I want to go to Mike Wazowski's. I'm like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I still remember that Italian video of like this fucking crow attacking a lady, and all you hear is ah, <laughs> ah in the background. Of the guy, and the guy just sounds so like he's like French or Italian. It sounds so nice, and they just hear in the background ah. <laughs> <laughs> I need to find that video. Uh, Joanne's man. was more local to me anyway for cosplay. I assure you, I have no idea what Joanne's is. Uh, oh, Joanne's fabrics. Or... Oh, is it, yeah. oh, okay, it's just uh, fabrics, okay. Yeah. There's a missile in here underneath one of the mushrooms. Ah, uh, right, right, right. But, it's, but it has all that radiation. That's dangerous. He, uh, you'll be fine. fine. You have more energy tanks. It's okay, five-second rule. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> just hold your breath, wash your hands, yeah. don't lick anything, you're fine. Now, I never, I never played Metroid Prime 3, but to my understanding, Metroid Prime 3's plot is indeed, oops, all radiation, correct? <laughs> <Pretty much. laughs> so maybe we yeah. shouldn't be as casual about this as we are. <laughs> eh, don't worry about it. Now, eat your face on. <laughs> well, uh, if I remember the plot right, it, it's like for... For the actual Metroid Prime, it was there was a Metroid there that the face on meteorite hit it, and then it got the radiation no, from. No, I I think it's be, I I think Metroid Prime as we know it was a, originally a Leviathan creature. Like I'm okay. not sure if it was a Metroid um, that got corrupted. In the um in the original um, GameCube release, I believe the story was the space pirates exposed the Metroid to the face on. It was more that they just found it. Yeah, I was gonna say because because uh, it contradicts uh, like an updated lore book they do later where they is like yeah. it's something they just found. Well, it's more just we detect something down there, but we can't get to the thing. But then it's like, wait, Metro Prime's got mechanical weapons. How the hell did they get that? Yeah, Oops, no, yeah. I'm Don't pretty worry sure about that it. <laughs> before the retcon, uh, it was created in a way, but then afterwards they're like, no, this is just how it is. Yeah. Um, I want to say that Prime 3 suggested that uh, the Phazon Metroids eventually grew into that. Okay. It basically <laughs> got uh, mute, mutated into, like, Phazon. Um, yeah, I, I, when you I, get I, to a phase at the end of the game, you can see, like, uh, a bunch of dead Metroid Primes. Because wow. I was going to say, like, really? I, was gonna say, like <laughs> I always just imagined it, like, the, the, uh, like, that Metroid was just minding its own business, looked up to the sky, it was just like, what the fuck? <laughs> We have wait, enough E-Tanks to get that artifact, but I'm not doing that. I wouldn't chance yeah. that at all. Yeah. Phazon, wait, is wait, no, wait. Phazon is no joke. It drains your health faster than anything wait, else in the game. Trav, what? where do you see the dead uh, Metroid yeah, Prime? I'm sending you a picture. It's, um, I it's in the room the right end. before the final boss. Yeah, I, you're posting it in uh, the server chat, or uh, Discord. There's a missile in this room. It's at like the, it's, uh, it's at the end of this hallway. It's on the ground. Yep, hidden underneath the fairy ring. You just fucking oh. bopped me in the head. Like, you didn't even Oop. suck my teeth. Like, you just bopped me in the head. Hee <laughs> hee. Boop. I, I, hey, Calico. I, 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 I love these things on a no 
spider ball slash no grapple beam rom because I just use them as platforms. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the only thing that, that I kind of hate is just the fact that they're not really the most dangerous thing in the universe. Metroids have never really been the most dangerous thing in the universe until now, because Samus has always been around. But Phazon Metroids are definitely dangerous because there is cancerous as Twitch chat. <laughs> oh the Phazon flowing through them. Johnny, you can't open the door. Talon Metroids are con the Talon Metroids though are never as big as a threat as like regular SR388 Metroids because they can be killed by any weapon. They're baby. Yeah, well, what they about are, the baby? Uh, is that the hallway over there? They're deliciously it's like gooey. Right down there. Yeah, the it's end. it's surrounded by like mushrooms and all that. Yep, that's. They just use conventional bombs. Or I can use power bombs. Oh no, I can use. You can use bombs. any normal bomb. Okay. Now, if you see a circle of mushrooms like that, they usually traditionally call it a fairy ring. A fairy uh, ring, okay. Because the idea uh, is, it's like it's supposed to be a portal to the world of the fairies, and not the nice kind of fairies. Uh, the kind of fairies that kind of steal oh, your children and replace them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and replace uh, them. <laughs> Yeah, that's a fungal fun fact for you. Yeah, <laughs> fungal fun fact. Wait, <laughs> as I look at my bottle of fairies from Ocarina of Time. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> what did you do? So, got, yeah, basically, only, you know, somewhat prettier, I guess. Um, basically, little... the pixies from Final Fantasy fourteen. I, yeah. I am. Which ones? The bad, the. Uh... All of them. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say all. <laughs> Here's our missile station scan. Awesome. There's only three of these for some reason. <laughs> and two of them are basically useless. Because you don't even really need the one in uh, the Elder, the hall near the Hall of the Elders. Uh, I mean, you might need this one. Maybe. But... Well, because you fight Chozo Ghost there. So maybe that's why. But, like, in the Impact Crater? Really? The ship's yeah. like four rooms, are right? <laughs> also, I have a question. That's too for, like... far. <laughs> What's up, Lincoln? What's up? What the fuck happened with Twitter? What do you mean? Oh, you mean the font in the oh, formatting? The font change. The yeah. font, the color is they, just like what? they they did a soft release of that a couple of months ago, and now I think now they're just doing a hard release everywhere. I don't like it. I don't uh, see I any mean, change. Oh, well, then it's it's probably being released in waves. Yeah, I've already seen it. So wait, oh, yeah, the it's already stuff, happened on my nice. browser too. But it's just but oh, it's changed it a browser or an app thing. Oh, probably Sorry, both go, at some point. Go backwards. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, I'm looking at my phone right now. It's just like white text with like. A weird color background, it's, like, uh, and, the, like and the font's also smoother too. I have an extension that like significantly changes how my Twitter looks, so I haven't noticed any difference yet. Yeah. but give it time. Yeah, I don't I've use any plugins for mine. I've also just got an extension that lets me customize the color of any page as I see fit. Mm. Are you not grappling onto that? I don't want to play both today. It seems it's been one of those little ass clowns. Glider. But, uh, Glider. Last Come minute replacement from Come the here. enemy of Super Metroid. Come here, sweet Is it a, it's supposed to be just, um, what the hell are they called? Rippers? Uh, yep. Yeah, they just go through Rippers. It's, 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 it's pretty much the same thing, though. Like, I, I understand what it is. Oh, the invisible, uh, fucking Dark Reader. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's just called Dark Reader. I think it's on Chrome and Firefox. Enforces dark mode on pages that don't support it, or you can change it however you want it. Oh, I have that too. I want I bright it, piss uh, yellow. I used dark it for reader? YouTube yep. Studio for a while, but uh, YouTube Studio just finally implemented uh, dark theme on its own. Off. Wait, wait, I... they finally got dark mode on YouTube? Uh, I do, at least. I, I, yeah. yeah, I got it on mine as well. Oh. So, there's just one missile expansion in here, and it's right at the end with the save station and the last of yeah. the pirate logs. It's a, so, it's a, it's an ice, if I remember correctly. It's in the tube, yeah. Yeah. I'm, I might have to download that extension for Twitter, because, like, I really do not like Twitter's dark mode. Something about the colors it uses. Really? Oh, I, I can't do it. Twitter's, Twitter's light mode is a fucking flashbang. It, it is, but I, I dislike the colors that Twitter dark mode uses more. Hmm. Like, the Whereas dark, I, usually like keep, the I usually keep mine on like um uh on dark with uh the green like is usually what I use and that uh I haven't really had an issue with that for on my I like end. the um I like the sort of dark mode that has the dark blue background. Yeah, that's uh, the one that I, I use. Oh, the I like dim mode, I think. Something like that. I, I'm not a fan of the like pitch black dark mode though. Yeah. I love it, especially with having an OLED phone. It's why I can't go back to the regular dark mode on uh, Discord. I have to use the OLED mode. Pain. 
I like the part where I load up Google and I get flashbang right in the eyes at 2 a.m. at night. <laughs> oh boy, let me go to Google and check it with this out. Flashbang, watch out! <laughs> you just hear the hype <laughs> on. Semi related to that, I've been doing this thing now where, like, when I'm super tired and I'm going to bed and I, uh, you just flashbang yourself? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, um, when I realize my phone is too bright, I'll be like, oh shit, it's bright, and then I turn down my volume. <laughs> turn down. <laughs> that's like, that's it. Yeah. I, don't, I don't catch myself doing that, no. I, 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 I said it before on Twitter, but I'll catch myself hitting what I think is the volume button on my iPhone. It's actually the power button. And when you hit the power button multiple times in a row in rapid succession, they're thinking you're doing an emergency oh, SOS. One. Oh, yeah, here. No. And it comes with a really obnoxious boop, boop. Oh, God. Thank you for scaring the shit out of me at 3 in the morning. The police are on their way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your point is exceptionally good. Uh, exceptionally good. I, I don't know what it says about how well I sleep that I don't think I've heard this yet. No, I haven't done it near you yet. No. Okay. Uh, I, I've definitely done it in the shower. <laughs> oh, God. Wait, you take your iPhone to the shower? No, I put my iPhone yes. next to the, uh, next, like in the sink, listen to music while I'm taking a shower, yeah. See, I can't do that because I'm always in fear of, like, uh, my phone getting ruined getting by, like, Getting ruined? No, I've been doing like it for that. years, my phone's probably fine. Yeah, I, I'm about I, to say there's steam and stuff like that is safe for your phone, so you're perfectly fine with that. Just don't, uh, just make sure it's not in your pants when you put them in the wash. No. I've done that once. I put my wallet hey, in my pants in the wash. If a, if, a, if a couple headphones can't survive, I'm pretty sure a $2,000 phone can. <laughs> oh, for what it's worth, my phone did actually survive the wash. It just burned out the uh, the backlight for the screen. So oh, I, I wow. kept using it for like two months after that. Well, speaking of $2,000 waterproof phones, uh, Samsung now has the uh, Model 3s for the Z Flip and Z Fold, and they're actually waterproof this time around, which is weird to see no, but they're, not, actually they're not a uh, they're not dustproof though that's for yeah sure. they're dust they're waterproof but not dustproof. imagine being conquered oh. by like the world's oldest enemy yeah dust dust, dust. which is but, just dead human skin cells but can i put my phone in the in the microwave to help it charge faster no no oh no. i love that i love that 4chan thread <laughs> But no, Johnny, no one can withstand the mighty power of dust in the Legion Tale. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I like his face on the left. <laughs> <laughs> that the face on right, guys. <laughs> this is the uh, normal version of Prime, right? The first one, uh, first revised one. No, no, no. Yep. The, oh, you're talking about the version of the game you gave. Yeah. Okay. So it's one point. Okay. Yep. So we no get problem. the we get the we no we get the true uh, in in goal for this fight. Okay. Both controllers work fine. The PlayStation 3 controller is basically brand new. Oh, nice. I got those controllers. Nice. Yeah, nice. it's getting it's getting really hard to find a decent deal on like actual original PlayStation 3 controllers these days. I I feel like the problem I run into with PS3 controllers these days is that like the control sticks all get gummy because the plastic's going bad. See, uh, I I always use a uh, third party one for the, my PS3 because I I don't, I don't like how the DualShock 3 feels honestly for, for so me. I always feel like PS3 it, it, controllers that are made for ants. <laughs> <laughs> it always feels like really cheap plastic that's going to snap at any point kind of deal. My I hands mean, never feel comfortable with it. If I if you I wouldn't the mind. DualShock, uh huh. Blue Sharky uh, power bomb shot doesn't work on one point out. No, that's a uh, Wii exclusive. Yeah. Uh, I wouldn't mind the PS3 controller better, uh, but the problem is like all the third-party ones don't have pressure-sensitive controls, and depending on what game you're playing, that's uh, really important. Especially when you don't want you don't want to murder someone in cold blood by accident. Why not? Uh, <laughs> I want to get a good rank. Oh, fair. Um, both of my uh, both of my PS3 controllers um, need to be plugged in. Like they uh. they can't manage. Uh, wireless anymore. Yeah, the battery's dead. Yeah. There might be a way of fixing that. I just haven't looked into it. Right. Does use a DualShock 4 on PS3? PS, uh, the PS, uh, DualShock 4 I... doesn't use pressure sensitive. Yeah, I tr uh, the first game I tried that on was Metal Gear Solid 3 and it didn't work. Ooh, yeah. you might be able to one cycle this if we get lucky. Please stop hitting me. Oh, I'm just fuck. Trying to I ended up the wrong goddamn thing. 
Alright. Ah, uh, damn it. That was so close. Yeah, that was oh, close. Well. I never one cycled this guy, but I've been really close. I've done it a few times, and it is just gorgeous when you pull it off. I'm gonna this let him. Ta I'm actually gonna let him take care of the pirates because the chocolate kills them. Oh, really? Five. I didn't know that. Yeah. Yep. There they go. <laughs> Still hate that the uh, the dual sense doesn't have um, pressure sensitive buttons. I mean, just the triggers. Ball doesn't have it. I know, but still, if they're going to go all out with the triggers, they may as well go all out with the face buttons, too. I mean, in theory, every button other than start and select on the PS2 controller was technically uh, analog slash pressure sensitive. I also found out that the original Xbox had pressure sensitive controls. I think for the triggers, yeah, but I'm not sure no, for the face buttons. It, it worked for the face buttons because you can do the, the uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 just putting your weapon away. Uh, if only that port of Metal Gear Solid 2 was actually decent. Uh, it's not. <laughs> it runs like absolute garbage. <laughs> yep. That's What's true. that? The the uh, the first chapter running at 30 FPS. What do you mean the game's meant to be running at 60? Oh no, the cutscene's running half an hour longer. Oh, oh no! <laughs> <laughs> God, Old Snake really has it rough now. <laughs> Okay, it's a PC worthy console, guys. It's the strongest thing on the Magic Way. Why are we being beaten by a PlayStation 2? <laughs> I love how the Omega Pyre is just like, yeah, you know what? Fuck you. I well, I think I've ever seen the. Uh, now I think about it, I think I've ever seen the. Uh, the. the Prime Suit with. The Fusion Suit? Yeah, yeah. Oh, get ready, because it's, it's exactly what you expect. The black. <laughs> we have the black dark no, suit. It's the okay, maybe, suit. Maybe it it's, burns. Uh, it burns. Oh God. Oh, it burns. Oh, oh, hey. I'm kind of vanilla. <laughs> That's disappointing. Oh, I look oh, normal. <laughs> uh, if, it's a shame we didn't have the um, normal thing on Pat yesterday. Otherwise, you would have seen gravity suit with a normal morph ball from the various suits. <laughs> hey, all this radiation and all it gave me was a uh, kind of generic normal suit. <laughs> So it gave me back have... my old suit. <laughs> also, since radiation we... poisoning. Yep, so since we got phase on suit, we may as well just go back and clear out this floor for the final uh, artifact down here. Mm -hmm. so yeah, because we, we want to go backwards. No, we don't want to go up. So we're not yet I mean, anyway. The way we can route this, I would say, is go back to the mining tunnel, grab newborn, then come back this way, grab the energy tank, the missile. We can then take a shortcut back to the second level. Which drops us right next to the access point to the surface level. And then from there, we can just clean the surface level out in one swoop, and then you can either leave via Magma or go to Town Overworld. Yeah, and then the rest of the vending machine have gone too far. Yep. This is like the third like, time boop. we've been in this room, and every time we come in, all I can think is this must be impossible to fucking see in if you're on a CRT. No, if, you're on, a, if you're on a CRT in with any sort of lighting in the room, it is impossible to see. You know what fucking got me the uh, when I found out that the hard way, uh, Snake Eater. Uh, there is a there is a there is a dark cavern that you crawl through. I think it was after uh, the oh, pain, fuck that area. right after yep. the, uh, the the ocelot the fight. The ocelot fight, and ocelot the Fury, yeah. you can't see fucking shit if your room is lit up in any capacity. It's well sucks. the trick. Well, the I trick for that is just uh, leave the game in. Go make a sandwich and then come back and then Snake's eyes gonna get fixed itself for a bit. <laughs> oh, yeah. use a cigarette, you bloody yank! <laughs> yeah, that's what I did. I used the cigarette. Oh, hear me out. Let's just do the smart brain surgeon. Let's just bump up the gamma on our TV. No. Oh. No, <laughs> cheating. Yeah. I don't want to turn it back. <laughs> he does have a point, though. Well, that's right. Mushrooms make you glow. They also re they also recharge their batteries. Yeah. I love I love that <laughs> Wait, conversation. What? It's like yeah, it's a secret conversation in Metal Gear Solid Three. There are certain batteries that you can sorry, there are certain mushrooms that you can eat, and if they do, for some reason, they recharge your batteries. If you then call Sigma, paramedic, paramedic, oh paramedic, yeah, and it's like hey, um, I ate these mushrooms and they can recharge the batteries, and those two are like, wait, what the fuck? the hell are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Snake, wait, 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 wait. are you crooked poles right now? <laughs> Snake, uh, we need to write this down as scientifically possible because if you uh, need to put, abort put, the put, mission and come back like right now, put it, <laughs> with, uh, put it right next to the fucking Metal Gear protocol. Get the, well, the, the, the recharging mushrooms, yeah, do it now. <laughs> uh, the best part about that is that you can use those mushrooms to cheese through the Vulcan fight. Wait, how? Wait, how? Uh, Vulcan, tent Vulcan has this weird superpower of shooting lightning. Uh, so uh -huh. if you just know the, so if you just throw the gold caps at the 
at the floor, uh, the lightning will go after that instead of you. <laughs> really? <laughs> they're what? Fucking, they're power conductors? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> really? No fucking yeah. way. <laughs> so someone who can shoot lightning out like a goddamn X-Man and defeated <laughs> by a freaking mushroom. Oh yeah, and he's afraid of frogs, so if you throw a frog at him, uh, yeah, he'll just <laughs> cower in fear. I need to play, replay that game now with so much Kura, information Kura, back Kura. down there. I mean, the best part is you can play the online now again. Uh, oh yeah, well, MGO One's been available for a while again. It's yep, MGO Two. Um, that's no, that's been back. Yeah. MGO One and Two. And then Three is dead because no one likes MGO Three. <laughs> yeah. I'm so glad this is not the PAL version because for some stupid reason they replaced all the Metroids here with the Fission variants. Yeah, you run. Yeah, that's right. You run some as soon as here. That fucking sucks. <laughs> yeah. Yep. I mean, you, if you have power bombs at this point, I mean, you have a few, so it's not. You can take care of a few, but it's like, damn. I hope you're not backtracking too much. We need a co-op Peace Walker. There's no way I can I mean, jump up here, is there? No. Uh, there is. No. We kind of killed no. our way of getting up there. Oh, easily. the Metroid. No. Wait, maybe if Linky. I can jump on this little piece of. I radio, have it on radiation. PS3 now. I can join you. No. <laughs> <laughs> No. We need, we need to recreate the human slingshot. Right. Hold on a second. P I have it a Dan. Ah, damn it. What about P Dan? Who said P Dan? You know I hate that P name. <laughs> Linky was like, "Hey, we should do a co-op of Peace Walker." I'm like, "No, no not P Dan again." Wait, who's P Dan? Yeah, you like Jason a lot. Who's P Diddy? What? Oh shit. So around the time John was doing his uh, Metal Gear marathon, that was when we were doing um, Peace Walker um, on our channel. And so we decided to record some co-op together so he could use the footage for uh, his Peace Walker review. You don't have a way of choosing lobbies. No. So anyone oh. can join your lobby. And we no. kept getting this random dude named P-Dan joining the lobby. <laughs> We'd have to exit out the game, go back in. And for Carson in particular, it would like... His PS3 just wouldn't connect to the internet after that, so we would have to wait for him to restart his PS3. It, it was a, it was specifically a mess, when it. it was P Dan. Yeah, uh, P Dan, or if like we had a connection error. Yeah, which those were obnoxious. I just imagined the fucking like Dinkelberg thing, but P Dan. <laughs> he <laughs> did. <laughs> I mean, it, to be fair, today who's playing Peace Walker online these days? So. Yeah. So you know what? Yeah, that's that's real. <laughs> if we just set up out, just get a lobby together with just like four of us, it's like, all right, let's go ahead and make a lobby, and it's just gonna be like three of us, and all of a sudden, be dead. Be dead. He's back. <laughs> Return of P Dan. This time, it's kind of personal. Uh, I thought they meant like that. I meant to like in the Zelda two game over screen. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who the fucking so the what would be a P Dan, but. It's just uh, a grunt with the mask on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're right. No, 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 no. It'll be the fucking I, grunt wait, from like. That E tank is, uh, the fuck is it? It's just through the door. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm thinking too hard. Oh, yeah, because no, it's behind no. a gate. That's right. Uh, e Dan yes. really want to play Peace Walker that day. <laughs> no, no, no. Like, oh, hey, I can just come through this area backwards, right? And skip the whole thing. And it's like, no. Nope. They see this energy tank? You can't have. Oh, by the way, the entire thing's irradiated. Get look, getting banged out alive. <laughs> fuck face. But uh, you remember that one guy from Edgar Saw 2 who's just like, it's a dud. That's be dead. A dud! No, a dud. I love how Federal, it's huh? That and plus the camera just like zooms on his face and it's like the most <laughs> weird face. Oh, ever. it's a dud. No matter. My, my favorite cutscene is uh, in there is the secret cutscene where Akiba is just taking a shit. Yeah. Oh, while, with like, the microphone. <laughs> Yeah, well, like, there's actual plot happening. You can just, like, slightly turn to the left. Like, I want to see what Johnny's doing. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> He's That's taking a shit. Right. Are you keeping an eye on Emma? Uh, no, man, I want to hear this guy taking a shit. Which sequence yeah. was that? Uh, that was whenever uh, you're listening, to, uh, finding uh, the dude with a heartbeat sensor thing. And uh, you basically okay. listen to the wall, listen to uh, not Solid Snake and uh, Ocelot talking. Couldn't you also do it while you're using the microphone with Emma? Uh, while she's crawling yeah. through the... Uh, yes. The yeah, floor. that's also yeah. another part. But uh, they actually interact with each other. Yeah, Rama is like, wow, that guy's weird. And if the, I learn and, anything, is not to mess with women in like in missions. What? <laughs> that's oddly specific. <laughs> just go. <laughs> oh, what a strange guy! A missile expansion in this room. It's there's there's one. The, on, uh, it's it's in the wall. Yeah, I remember that yeah. one. It's a challenge Eliza. shitting. I also <laughs> like the uh, I also like the part where you like if you listen to Emma, she just starts like 
complaining like, about like Raiden's hair. <laughs> yeah, and then you can actually call her and be like, right, "What's wrong with my hair, you bitch?" I love shooting this dude because he he goes far as hell. I want to see how many distance, how, much, how many meters. Take a shot. Oh, he didn't go very far at all. Well, that wasn't exciting. Uh, oh my god. Boo. Experiment. Remember, the, remember the playthrough where the guy was just like so bugged out, he was just like fucking everywhere. <laughs> uh, your dude was dangling from a corner for a good five minutes before he disappeared. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, Baltimore. Hurry up, asshole. Uh, in my recent playthrough of uh, MGS4, I forgot that, like, when Akiba shits himself, he actually gets a, like, in-game shit stain. Oh. oh. Why did I have to put that much detail into shit? You're saying this, this to someone... This is genius Kojumbo. Kojima sa... was ahead of his time. You're saying this to a team <laughs> that programmed fully multiple ice cubes in a goddamn PS2 game with full detail for no reason. Other than to have it for shits and gigs, I guess. I don't believe it. And uh, Kojima uh, is god. Koji Kojima, Kojima, we spent Kojima is god. Yeah. Come on, Kojima. We spent over over two years learning how to code on the PS3, and you want us to great what? Uh, I need you to it's make a fun. dude taking a shit. <laughs> All right. But, uh, can well, we bring back the Moe statue, please? <laughs> well, if, if he's they god, did in the five. Okay, so uh, Kojima's supposed to be Gordon, or what the fuck happened with Zone of the Enders 1, Dubber? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Yeah. It's fine. God, uh, it. God works in mysterious ways. Two. <laughs> <laughs> now, Wait, Linky. I... Linky, have you not seen the Maui statue from 5? Oh yeah, I've seen, seen it. Seen I, 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 I love that cutscene where it's just like... <laughs> 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 just for that fucking Maui statue. Wait, oh, I mean, it could be worse. Kojima asked for not oh, only... Uh, Conan O'Brien to make sexy otter noises for Death Stranding, yeah. <laughs> but he also <laughs> had them program in realistic piss physics <laughs> as a weapon. Dude, Death Stranding was fantastic. Scare off the ghosts by pissing on them. Yeah, <laughs> what a that, that, that's the whole mechanic. Just, just throw your shit, piss, <laughs> piss and blood at them. Yeah. Fuck no, it. don't even throw it. Just uh, zip, yeah. unzip your pants. Challenge yeah, straight pissing. up piss on the ghosts. Yeah, I'm like, what? <laughs> the ghosts are just like looking down at Mr. What's-His-Name's face and be like, are you just taking a fucking piss? He's like, yeah, what the fuck are you guys doing? I'm saving my face. life! <laughs> I, 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 I fucking love Death Stranding, but god, man, it, it's an acquired taste, that's for sure. No, I think anyone can enjoy it. Right. Uh, and Linky, question? no, Go you're ahead. not doing it near them, you're doing it on the ghosts. Yeah, you are <laughs> pissing on the ghosts. I don't want to piss on ghosts. <laughs> Too bad. No, well, was, was that which I was like, they yeah, fly away. Okay, that's right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> you know what? That pretty much explains why all the monster energy drinks in the game. Oh yeah, dude, you have yeah. a canteen that filters monster energy drink from the rivers. <laughs> I, I do you not love, pee I, blood at that point for drinking all that energy drinks? <laughs> I mean, well, you Link, do throw blood at them. No, Link, pee blood. blood. <laughs> no, no, you never cross the streams. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Well, that's all. That's all. Linky, <laughs> like, yeah, I hate to tell you this, but there is no way to play a non-scatological run of Death Stranding. <laughs> hey, I did use. <laughs> hey, no, no. Wait, why are you telling me there are speed runs of Death Stranding where it's no scat percent? <laughs> hey, I didn't use the shit grenades at all in my playthrough. But I did use the piss grenades. <laughs> you were joking. No, I'm <laughs> serious. <laughs> Every I time you take a shit, uh, this man's like, I took your shit and put it into a grenade. <laughs> Why? We found a way without because using the shit. No shit. It works on the <laughs> it could ghost. Be worse. There's Norman Reedus shower water grenades, yeah, too. Go yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we have to go, because yeah, if we, we try to... going backwards, um, so you know that wall was supposed to blow up? It has collision on the back of it. Oh, shit. It's time to take a piss. There's Norman Reedus shower water grenades, too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Shower. Dude, when I play that game, it's literally water. shower water. Yeah. He takes a shower and they put it in the grenade. Yeah, you know, I can use this. <laughs> Why don't Norman Reedus stay in the shower for like 18 Jesus, hours? Jesus, Kojima? And... Why are you so goddamn strange? It's Kojima's vision, damn it. <laughs> this is the future. <laughs> I hold still while I throw the shit at you. <laughs> Globalist piss simulator. <laughs> <laughs> just, I, I, I literally just imagined Kojima talking to like the Sony executive. So, Mr. Kojima, what do you want? I want to see Ro Norman Reedus piss and shit. Wait, hold on Excuse a second. Excuse us. I'm backwards. Uh, sh uh. Yeah, yeah. Oh. oh my God, there's a wall. Oh shit! Yeah, Are you not supposed to? Yeah, you're supposed to come in from the other side, but because we came in this backwards, um, they kind of saw us coming and put collision on the other side because fuck us, I guess. So uh, what do we do? 
Do we just scan this? We have to go back through the way we came, do the puzzle of shame, and... Oh. oh well, at least I, get I to didn't hear that, because everybody was talking about challenge pissing and shitting. <laughs> if we get back to the second level, at least, you can try and go for the grapple beam, and that should just lock you straight up to the top. Okay. Wait, I thought you already got the grapple beam. We did, but we, did. we have to get back. We have to go around the long way. We're not soft locked. We no, we're not soft locked. We just have to take a detour. Yeah, yeah. Why, well, did, they they add, why, why did they add collision? <laughs> I don't know, because I tried going that way on the, the test from years ago. Rock. <laughs> oh, Ian, uh, were you the one who won the switch from the uh, raffle? Yes. Is it Ian Bo? Yes. Do me a favor and DM me later. <laughs> Give it back. <laughs> <laughs> Death shitting, thank you. <laughs> uh, I can't wait for the deluxe edition. Hopefully they add the ability to actually listen to music on the go. Yeah. If they don't, I'm hey, gonna wait, be so mad. Wait, there is no MP3 in that game. I, there, well, is, there is, but it's only it's in, in the... like your home base. Yeah. It's not gonna need red. Uh, yeah, the end. Yeah. This would be it would be preferably. Because I got to make sure I get your switch out to you. I fucking love the sound of that stranding. It's so. The music that's in that game is Discord fantastic. I, I said the, Discord. The mo the moment you hear uh, I think a silence for the feelings is when like the game clicked with me. I'm like, yeah, this this game is great. Uh, for me, it was Discord um, or Twitter, Linky. I, I said Discord. <laughs> it's Discord. There you go. Sorry, everyone was speaking over you. So you're good. The the game Death Stranding clicked for me when they're like, "This death body, death body, dead body <laughs> will create a a crater if we don't destroy it." And I'm like, "What the fuck is happening?" <laughs> and then that cutscene happens where the big mouth thing eats a dead body and then explodes, and I'm like, "I love it." <laughs> Do they ever explain why bodies explode when they die? Yeah. Yes. I mean. Okay. Isn't the first dead body you had to have to deliver your fucking mom, who's also the president? Yeah, who's also the president, who's also your sister. What? Hey, you're that part! You? <laughs> He's also an immortal time god, but we yeah, brush yeah. over that we, we quite don't, often. We don't talk about that part. Aww, I thought that Metro eclipsed into the wall. No, no, I thought no, so you too. Really you reel that shit back. You reel uh, that shit. Can we go back. through and back through here? They barely mention it. Uh, <laughs> if anyone, if anyone I, says I it's not the spoiler, that's it's the not. first time I've heard that kind of reaction from Nora in a long time. It's, and the best part's not really much of a spoiler because it's like what in the first couple hours of the game. Yeah. Yeah. And after like the first mission, they explain. You might be able it. to stand on that little mechanism power bomb thing and just go straight to the grapple beam point. Well, honestly, oh, me. that's God, the bad part me. about Death Stranding, is that after the first couple hours, there's really no story until, like, the last <laughs> last yeah, few hours. It's just like Phantom Pain. <laughs> yeah. yeah but, but, at least, but at least with Phantom Pain, you have a Walkman to, like, guide you through. I do like yeah. it when uh, I get picked up by a tornado that takes me to World War II. <laughs> I'm only half processing Whoa, the shit that's coming out of your guys' mouth, for the record. That's good. It's, yeah. It was just a preview to Battlefield Portals. <sighs> Where's that shit? <laughs> Can we say Yeah, uh, hey Kojima, what's with all the dead whales in your game? That's uh, doable. No reason. Yeah, that's, that's doable. That's what the fuck is Death Stranding supposed we... to be? Um, nice. Nationalism? It's a Strand Other game. Room. The F yeah, in Strand a... stands for Strand. It's a, it's a Strand-like. <laughs> <laughs> Strands that bind us. I, I I wish you guys could see my face right now because I'm just like, what the fuck? I unironically I did love Death Stranding and I I would recommend people try it. You might not like it, but that's okay. Yeah. Well, you don't know until you try. Yeah. 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 I mean, it's got your favorite pastime of throwing shit around, becoming monkey, <laughs> uh, carrying a baby around, carrying your dead mother who's also your sister who's also a time god. <laughs> What the fuck am I saying? Yeah. <laughs> as crazy as it sounds from the way that we describe it, it is just a very chillax game. It's it, just is, it, it is wind a, down. It, it, it is, is so a therapeutic. Great, a great <laughs> podcast game. Yeah. <laughs> well, now uh, we can clear up this level so we can get the missile expansion that's in here. I, I just can't yeah. wait for the deluxe edition so I can buy the game, uh, the director's cut, so I can buy this game yet a third time, possibly fourth, depending if the uh, if it's the, street, the Steam Deck can actually run it. Just add an MP3 option, please, for the love of God. <laughs> uh, a podcast game is a game where you like put on a podcast while playing it and just listen. Yeah, vibe. it's something that you don't really need to tune in because there's a lot of environmental noises. 
you're literally walking and holding both triggers the most of the game. Yeah. <laughs> you, you you know that one clip of a uh, uh crap. What's that Kong's name again? Uh, Funky Kong, just like telling you it's a good time or you're a good guy and all that sort of thing. Just play that for 15 hours and there you go. I have no idea what Funky. you're talking about. You haven't heard of the uh, the legendary trilogy of Funky Kong picks you up from the airport? Yeah, no. that one. <laughs> no, not at all. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's basically a AMSR thing. ASMR. Hey, Mr. Recon, thank you very much for the Switch Prime. Thank you, thank you. Johnny, that one tweet I put about like the the Sonic Four video, you yeah. know, when it first went up to now thing, that thing is over like a thousand likes. Yeah, now. which is weird because uh, I'll start with first off, thank you for the raid, Party of Five, much appreciated. Like you didn't retweet that or anything, right? No, or... no, it's uh, I I liked it. Uh, I know that probably gave it a bit. Of I guess a boost. it just alerted but, everybody. But the, but the thing is, is that someone made that exact same tweet for the Sonic Three video, or uh, maybe the Sonic Two video, and it's just like maybe people, more people just were relate. There yeah, for the Sonic Four it's video. Like, yeah, maybe sure. I, I, I'm not sure. Oh, Lewis did a great job for that, by the way. Like, oh yeah. Uh, I wanted to make that the first video that he, I wanted to edit from because he's looking to become uh, an editor. Uh, just to make some money, and uh, I, I gave that to him, and I didn't give him much direction for the script, but he fucking just went to town, and he did a yeah, phenomenal Yeah, I, I, I saw the video. Yeah, I was I really impressed by, like, all the visual edits that he did yeah. and stuff like that throughout that. But it was also, yeah. like, just, I need this video done by here, <laughs> because I gotta, I gotta attach a sponsor to it, and I got deadlines. Uh, but he, like, uh, he was clearly having a blast with it. I think it helped because it was also Sonic 4. Yeah, I could, he doesn't uh, like that game, so... <laughs> I think the, uh, the gag of Sonic reaching for the mobile phone with Flappy Bird yeah. is... Yeah, uh, it's one of my favorite edits. I, I, I told yeah. him, like, uh, cause he sent, he sent me uh, other edits in, uh, in bits and pieces, uh, during the work in progress, and when he got to that, I was like, uh, first off, this right here is 7.30, fantastic. Made me laugh my ass off. <laughs> yeah. It was really good. Yeah. Because I, I think I remember. Uh, is that thunder? Like I remember. Yeah, that is. Uh, oh, okay. I sub to you. I think just before Sonic Four came out. Like I think the first video that I actively saw new was the uh, <laughs> Sonic Three CD and Knuckles and Knuckles one. Oh man. Yeah. So <laughs> that was the first That's one the that. Because I think the other the like. Classic oh, Sonic reviews were all done by that point, so like this was the one that made me feel, oh god, I'm getting old now at this point. Yeah, the the whole Sonic the portable thing blew my mind. I had no idea about that. Yeah, admittedly, I wish there was a little more research on it because uh, it is more, uh, it is more conjecture on my end, but it's one of those. It makes so much fucking sense. It, what, yeah, the thing that, that was pretty the much thing, all the stuff that was on Sonic Retro. Yeah, because uh, the thing that got me, that, that took me aback, was the fact that the fucking Sonic the Portable graphic was not changed in the Ferris wheel. I didn't know that like, one until you pointed like, it out. You couldn't edit it. <laughs> like, like, that was just a texture. It, it has to be a simple texture. It and you couldn't, nice of you couldn't bother bother finishing that? We gotta get flamethrower. Yeah, yay. Everyone's favorite weapon. Well, I mean, this is the same publisher that uh, couldn't be bothered to not have fan art in their game. God, you're... Oh my god, I remember oh, that. Which game? I remember I that. I remember oh, that, that was the uh, Sonic, uh, no, not Teak Sonic, uh, the original uh, Sonic, Sonic and Sega Sonic also, also racing, yeah. It did have fan art? Well, it yeah. was on the casino stage for like one of the playing cards. Uh, I forget, whatever Sonic's sister was in had, uh, yeah, Underground. Sonic Underground. Sonya. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, uh, so, well, so they had a piece of uh, Sonya fan art that uh, used for the Joker card. They, d But the thing is, uh, Sumo didn't realize that was fan art and wasn't official art, so they patched it out. But uh, the Wii version, because you can't patch those games, uh, it still has it in there. So, yeah. uh, whoops. Yeah. Oh, I love this, because this is like the introduction of the uh, the, the Wave Trooper. I love, I love the little, like, posing thing. It's like, it's like he's laughing. It's like, what the fuck is that? Like, like, Didn't that also happen uh, with uh, <laughs> with Mother Three Art in uh, the Ultimate? It, it also happened with fucking Persona Five. There's some like someone's Persona Four fan art is in there. Is I want to say like one of the calendars, and it's like, hey, I realize y'all like probably googled this, but don't you have high res images of your own? <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, don't you have like. A resource? Yeah, is it the guy who like did the art for Persona 4 on your team right now? 
I just Don't killed my own work. Don't you smell his work <laughs> You couldn't have just asked him to do another? <laughs> I mean, I'm nor I remember. I, I was gonna say, I was gonna uh, say did you hear, no. Did you, did you no, hear no, the cursor they left like... in the... Oh, sorry. Yep. Did you okay, hear about the cursor they left in the video? I do remember that! Uh, Please elaborate. That's so, fine. there there are points in Persona 5 where, like, usually it's in the boss transitions. They have a bunch- they have a bunch of, like, screen caps that they took for, in, like, debug mode. And, like, you can occasionally see them when you, uh... When you fast-forward through cutscenes right before you go fight a palace boss. Uh, one of them just straight up has a fucking computer cursor in it. <laughs> I, I, what I was gonna say is like I, I was I thought we were that uh like they used fan art thing. I was like, man, I thought you were going to where like that was the resale poster that you could like find on the digital displays uh in town. I was like, oh, that's gonna be a lot worse kind of deal. And that would be a lot worse because those are everywhere. But no, I think it's just like the calendar. You okay. <laughs> And as well, again, this is also the same publisher that accidentally released multiple games for free through their demos. Yeah, so many times. Yeah. Look, I can't look. I can't complain. The Yakuza Six demo actually gave me my Yakuza addiction. <laughs> <laughs> How do they keep doing it? Don't worry about it. Just, just take it. <laughs> At this I, point, I, I feel like it's intentional. I understand it's like it's more difficult than we think it is to just like package a vertical slice into a demo, especially if it's one of those demos where like you can carry over your progress into the full game. But also like, how does this keep happening? Like I'm. It should be on they just a checklist. It <laughs> it, it might, maybe they consider it good marketing. I don't know. I no mean, such it thing worked as for bad me. Yeah, I ended up just, like, after playing Yakuza 6, I ended up literally buying the entire series, so... But there you go! Well, I mean, <laughs> I guess Google is kind of the same way, because with the, they kept having issues with the Pixel phones kinda... leaking. Oh, uh, who's ready to softlock? So softlock. What, what can cause a softlock here? You exit the room. That's it. That's it? Oh, that's because the artifact won't appear. Yep, uh, it's the whole yeah. uh, main research in Metroid Prime 2 all over again. Uh, Google kept having issues with uh, their Pixel phones being leaked before the official announcements. Like one where someone had a prototype phone and they left it at a bar on accident. Oh, that happened with <laughs> one the, uh, where that, someone that happened... leaked company assets. And so now Google's finally been like, okay, you know what? Screw it. We'll just leak it ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> that, uh, if I recall, that happened with the iPhone 4 or 3G, yep. one of them. It was the iPhone 4 or the 4S. Yeah. And it also happened with the PSP Go, if I recall. Uh, I believe yeah. Randy Pitchford also did something similar that got oh, him in no, hot water. No, oh god, can we not? No! <laughs> I know exactly what you're talking about, too. Uh, Is that the uh, the magic trick he keeps talking about? <laughs> magic trick. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, Terry, that leak. Terry didn't, get, Terry didn't get leaked by Nintendo. What happened was uh, the SNK... Uh, copyright was added like the day before. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't know what all that means, but I'm just gonna nod my head. <laughs> Listen, if y'all want to know what the fuck child. you're talking about with Randy, go Google that one on your own. Yeah, <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Where Surfshark VPN? <laughs> Why is Randy so greasy? <laughs> <laughs> Are there any more additional power logs up here? Uh, there might be one or two, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna there's keep a missile going. expansion up top anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, because we're well, back in the cannon room. Uh, Once you've got everything cleaned in here, if we check our pirate logs, we should only have one missing. Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna put my uh, Raycons in. Yeah, that's fine. Don't put them in the microwave, though. Oh, you're there's you. I'll do whatever I want with them. That's, it's my money. <laughs> I hope you use the code Johnny15, mister. Oh, I use Johnny 40. I'm a fucking idiot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, used to, I thought it makes sense. You played that game so much. <laughs> See, I wanted to do 4.6. 4 4.6. It was like, all right, listen here, smart ass. Damn, there's really 14 other Johnnies. <laughs> How yeah. many Johnny? here? Why was he called Johnny? I, was Johnny 5 I, the fifth one? Johnny 5. I was going to say, like, well, if you read JoJo Part, uh, part 7, you would know. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh yeah, that's the uh, new anime be coming out next uh, this December. Yeah, December. December. Yeah. Uh, I still need to watch part five. I wonder how they're gonna start it off because at the very beginning, Jolene is masturbating. Excuse me. <laughs> he yep. sure is. She sure is. <laughs> Uh, I personally, I'm wondering how the fuck they're going to, if they're going to bother adapting the Bruce Willis joke. Spoiling, <laughs> spoiling, uh, the Sixth Sense once again. Oh, I mean, if you, I watching. don't think it's that big of a deal. <laughs> yeah, I keep saying it, I want to see the fucking Disney joke. I want to see yeah, the, the Bohemian Rhapsody arc is going to be <laughs> interesting. I, all, all I want them to do for Bohemian Rhapsody is they still clearly say the names, but there's just a clear sensor <laughs> beep every time they say Mickey. Oh, just like with um, Pop Team Epic with uh, yeah. The Shining. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, dude, you can't say that. <laughs> what do you mean I can't say The Shining? <laughs> I want to see, see the crazy shit they're going to come up with both the stand names and the actual, like, <laughs> names of Disney. Well, well some that of them we the already know no, the officials wait. of Thanks All-Star Battle. Something hurt me. Is something yeah, there's a pirate. Was that a camera? No, there was a pirate. Oh, there was a pirate. Oh, okay. I thought for some reason, like, the laser managed to... I was like, what was the hitbox <laughs> in that laser? Chat. What's so special about the KKK being JoJo Part 6? They were also in Gargoyles. We had Nazis in part two, and no also, one batted an eye. Also, they are in Florida. <laughs> that makes sense. It's always Florida. It's the it, one at nine o'clock. If the door is twelve. Oh, I thought we were still talking about Florida. What nine o'clock? <laughs> yeah, that should be good. Filthy acts done at a reasonable price. Oh God, that, I hope yeah, we get that's, a part that's seven. That's part seven. Um, the official translation to that is D4C. It's what they use in all-star battle. Oh, dirty. Fuck. Yeah, dirty deeds done dirt cheap. Yeah. 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 I mean, E four C is what everyone like abbreviates it to, anyways. But then the question becomes: Okay, so what does E four C stand for? Don't worry about it. He's it nuts. For, it stands for <laughs> filthy acts done at a reasonable price. How the fuck does that make sense? It just makes sense. Don't worry, worry about it. This thing is right. glacial waste. Yeah, so, yeah that's that's back in the. Uh, all right, so we can get the hell out of here. Are we done? Yep. I believe we're done. Yep, All right, do we go back the way we, do we want to go back the way we came, or do we want to go through this door? You may as well just break that door open and then just go straight down to Magmore, or you can... Yeah, that'd be faster anyway, because we can use the shortcut to go out via the surface level <laughs> if you want to do that. Okay, that one's pretty good. Dimes for Crimes. Yeah, that I just one. thought that one. <laughs> oh, Dimes for Crimes is good! <laughs> uh, Arts and Crafts, my favorite stand name. Arts and Crafts. Okay, I, I have to ask something about just kind of going back to... Uh... To Death Stranding for one last moment. Oh boy. Uh, with them releasing the director's cut, how long do you think it's going to take for the games to be uh, removed off of storefronts from licensing issues with having all these celebrities? Oh. And the music. Oh. All I'm saying is uh, make sure you got your physical copies. <laughs> I, I, I don't think the music would be a problem. I would think the celebrity would be a problem. Uh, because the licensed music is like low roar and they're pretty indie, so they should be fine. Yeah. I didn't think about it having to get removed for. Uh, but yeah, the uh, the celebrity guest cast, yeah, that could probably be a problem. With Conan O'Brien, who basically makes dolphin noises. No, Who's not just Conan O'Brien well, and and uh, Jeff Norman Keeley's Reedus. in there too. Yeah. Wait, Jeff Keeley's in the game? Yeah, yeah Jeff Keeley's in the game. Oh, that fucking so. course he's in the game. Of course, like I. I, I, I... <laughs> <laughs> They're fucking roommates at this point, so why wouldn't he? Be? Yeah. <laughs> I think we are going by a surface level. Yeah, and Jinji Ito, you know, the godfather of horror. Well, modern horror. I feel like oh. Kojima, Jeff uh, Keighley, and Mads oh Mikkelsen just have like. Uh, um, standing on. Don't yeah. worry about oh. it. 1.0. I'm standing on. I'm standing on 1.0. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, cool. More collision to abuse in the future, I guess. Awesome. All right, I'll keep that. Yeah, because that te that's technically another method of getting past the grapple beam point. Quick, John, name the tech. Name the tech. Oh, yeah, yeah. You uh, discovered it. Fucking uh, challenge pissing. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, because that's where we just talked nothing about right, challenge. Uh, where did you so get hurt from? I just need some quiet here. I need to do this two frame challenge pissing right here. 1.0. One point out. <laughs> It's the challenge piss! Now this is challenge piss. Seven. 
Oh, are you stuck? <laughs> no, oh, you stuck. do appear to be stuck. No, she's This isn't slowly... spider ball, it's called water spider. I think she's slowly going down? Or it could be the camera angle fucking with me. Can you power pop or anything? No, you are moving. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm moving very, very slowly. Are you GBJ? Yo, you I think you might be GBJ. You get that I'm building up speed. Yeah. Ah, I got it. <laughs> Samus got hit with the Smash Bros. lag right there. Okay, it's all fun. And all you hear from like Samus is like uh, dial up noises. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Just dial up noises. Yeah. Yeah, we can build infinite speed with a morph ball, and I, I can actually um, fucking oh. cause a visual headache. I remember doing that for uh, early power bombs. I'm aligning my QPUs. <laughs> Wait, where are you going? No, yeah, I, you I, that honestly the confused the hell out of me. Now I'm disoriented. You just need to go down to the bottom, take the leftmost um, uh, you mean water. Here. Thank you. Yep. Yeah, thank you. That legit was like, all right, that was funny. What am I doing again? <laughs> <laughs> challenge pissing, Johnny. Challenge pissing. What are you doing challenge pissing on a Wednesday night? <laughs> Alone, challenge pissing. On oh, Friday so that's evening. the Dodger, Dodger of Nairab. I was going to say Dodger of Nairab. Dodger with the board! It's, it's so Saturday that's what a Bakia was doing no in Mark date. 5. That's challenge fine. pissing. <laughs> my old Rush mixtape. Let's fuck. Why do we have a day for everything? <laughs> Why is it God. always a Rush day? <laughs> I'm so happy I have that at Modern Guilty Gear. <laughs> Oh, it's, good. it's really good. <laughs> Which mod? <laughs> I have no date. A 16 ounce bottle of Shasta and my All Rush mixtape. Heaven or hell, oh, yeah. let's rock. <laughs> uh, I'm going to be playing that game at some point in my goddamn life. <laughs> That's how I feel. Like, I want it, but I'm not in a rush to get it. What, Guilty Gear? Hey. Yeah. yeah. The, best part, the best part about the Guilty Gear franchise is they go on sale constantly, so you just wait a bit and it's gonna go like to like ten dollars. Yeah. Oh, I, I, what I'm probably gonna do, I'm probably gonna do what Fonzie's been doing and just, just fucking mother shit. Out I think of I got Rev Two for like five bucks. <laughs> you know. Well, gotta do. Though I'm gonna skip up on the nude mods because. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what, Linky? Nothing happened. Don't shut up. <laughs> No, Thank no, no! I, I'm talking about those mods that uh, Oni poster. Remember? Hey, yeah, thanks for the gift. I appreciate mod. that. Oh. Linky's skipping on nude mods. I never thought I'd see the day. Look, it's because he doesn't want to get accidentally banned. Like I almost got them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Fonzie almost got me banned for showing nudes. That's understandable. <laughs> I'm glad you understand. <laughs> I did nothing wrong. You said it was okay. Yeah, yeah, I did, but. <laughs> You trust me, right? <laughs> yes, I trust you with my life. Oh, genius! <laughs> Just the porn up theme starts playing. <laughs> I trust you with my life. Hey, yeah, I didn't tell you how live you like how alive you're gonna be. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. There it is. Rejected ease with their have a nude mod. You have a wife. Uh. <laughs> Kill wife. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Look, white fight back. <laughs> Excuse me? White. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. oh, oh. Right. Yeah. You said wife. <laughs> you said wife. I, I thought I heard white fight back. <laughs> I, was I like, heard oh. why. Yeah, no. Oh, okay. No, I heard white right. fight back. Right. <laughs> right wife. Oh, no, the life. save room's over here. Wife good. Yep. Wife fight back. Kill, Kill wife. Wife. Kill. wife gone. Kill. 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 Wife. Regrets. <laughs> no, there's no. Yeah, yeah. Get new wife. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah. I keep thinking like the small like the room back. is a save room, and it's like no, it's actually the one that has a tunnel in the back. It's also the one that's colored blue on the door. There we go. <laughs> also, I just, right. got a, I just got a very good picture of Diego in a very good pose. He looks like Twitter. he is just he is just he is just like vibing. How's uh How's Diego doing with the house? Uh, he is living his best life. We, like, if it weren't for, like, concerns yep, about Selene, we could probably release him from baby jail. <laughs> is, he, is he named after the scary monster, Super Creeps? Uh, no. We got, that's the name he had at the, uh, at the shelter, which apparently he was named after an Umbrella Academy character. I don't watch it, so I don't fucking know it. Wait, wait, wait. What was it? Uh, Diego. Uh, Diego. I've tried to... Fuck. I got sneeze. I got sneeze. Well, we can get the Chozo ghosts. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Allergies run deep, buddy. 
No, it, it won't fucking come out. Come up. Sneeze. Damn it. Yeah, I'm not sneezed. Sneeze. 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 Ah, that was like the yet. worst sneezes. It's Samus. the sneeze knees. Fight some Chozo ghosts, Samus. <laughs> yep. Fight time. your grandpa. And Ozpath's here. Yeah. Basically the other two beams that we didn't use. Yep. Well, we you didn't use probably... any of them, technically. Oh, that's right, because we uh, we jumped on the nipple. We did Excuse? nipple jump. Yeah, we did nipple jump. Okay. Now, this isn't Grandpa, nor Grandpa would never toss cum out my eyes at you. This is the racist uncle. Oh, I thought you said cum. Cum on your eyes. Yeah, I thought it was like, that's uh, that's uh, that's definitely an attack I remember Goku using. Never low and cum. <laughs> hey, you're strong. Hey, you're strong. Come I'll fight you. on your eyes. I want to fight you at your best. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can actually use the missile recharge station because we're pretty low. Oh yeah, that's right. Look at that. Oh, there, then there it is. Experiment. Si there it is. Si situationally useful. Yeah, it only took twenty go. years. Absolutely, man. <laughs> but uh, thanks, good question. thanks, guys. You sacrificed maybe <laughs> ten megs of space on the disc just for us. You know, I appreciate it. It's very humble. Uh, what are you hearing? Still Ghost Tracker, a typical Wednesday stream. If I'm being real. Yeah. 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 I didn't. I no. It's like you know. I don't like that. Do it again. I really liked how that felt. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna give this thing some yeah, use today. Like Samus, One more time. Let's go. Yeah. Listen. Yeah. How often do people with power suits come through here? That thing hasn't gotten used in years. <laughs> it's practically oh. brand spanking new. Uh, oh. Ice beam first. Yeah, the shows are really like make their tech to last. <laughs> 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 And I mean, how many years since they wiped out? I think uh, the resource that they use is uh, check notes ah Nintendium. I think <laughs> <laughs> that's tough. Oh, tough. Ah, so this God. is where it went after the uh, Game Boy Advance and GameCube was made. No wonder the Wii onwards was so prone to breaking. <laughs> ancient, Man, really uh, ancient advanced early uh, Egyptian burbs of fanciness stole it all. Can't have shit in this universe. So I actually okay. do got a question. I actually do got a sort of related Metroid question, hmm. but what would you guys do if they actually bring back Chozo Ghosts in the new Metroid Dread game? I mean, they're bringing back Chozo, like living Chozo. That's close. Yeah, enough. like actual living Chozo. So if why have ghosts? ghosts when we can have actual yeah, yeah, actual Chozo? Chozo. Exactly. Well, well, at least ghosts. They basically do all this crazy shit. Those regular ones are just like, yeah, I'm a bird. The regular ones are more dangerous. No, I'm just having them walking, talking skeleton Chozos. Yeah. Oh there God. you go. What is a skeleton's favorite snack? <laughs> oh, God, this one says puns. Ribs! Ribs! <laughs> My favorite part Ribs! of that video is just the, Why must you fail me so often? <laughs> Why must you fail me so often? <laughs> I hate though. that no! video because I recognize no! it as the back of a party city. <laughs> What was that video from again? It sounds so familiar. It's this guy with uh, a skeleton toy just asking like this. If you YouTube like, what is a skeleton's favorite snack, you'll get it. it. It should be the first one. Why are you laughing? I haven't told the punchline yet. <laughs> oh, I was waiting for the rest of it. <laughs> oh yeah, it's the first thing that popped up. It's a great Only video. bones. Oh, I like that these pirates like put every resource in the can to try and find these things, and they couldn't detect a door under a damn statue. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you need like five dudes to push that statue away, and like we don't got five dudes. They had elite pirates. No, we had five. We had five dudes before they were mangled for the morph ball technology. <laughs> so, yeah. No, no. So, so I, what happened is, is uh, like, hey, like go find them, but just don't bother touching the statues. They're sacred. Like we're pirates, we yes, yeah, but let the respect there, yeah. God, I love the idea of the pirates pirate respecting yeah, the boost in both like marks. Do like you the think we are Hobby Lobby? <laughs> See, I love, I love the pirate logs uh, that you get in Metroid Prime because you can just tell it's the one intern that is just <laughs> so fucking done. <laughs> It's I think my, fa my favorite one, it's, I forget if it's uh, Prime 2 or Prime 3, but it's basically one where it's after Dark Samus. It's just like, now there's two of them going. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's the second uh, Prime 2, last log of the Space Pirate area. It's like, there's two hunters. Surely we are cursed. Yeah, we are absolutely cursed. <laughs> yeah. This fucking I mean, sucks. <laughs> that would have to be uh, Prime the 2. What's I wrong, John? Yeah, I thought you would like the half bite. No, I was talking about the pirates, not the half bite. <laughs> I'm actually responding to the conversation. God damn! Leave me alone. Wait, whoa, wait. 
Junji Ito became a VTuber? What? And he said poggers. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Wait, who? What? Who? Huh? This is, this is really... Where's the quarter? The oh, it's over there. Uh, who, who's Junji Ito? Uh, have you ever seen... Uh... The Enigma of Amigara Fault? This, yeah. is, this hole was made for me. Wait, that oh. dude? That yes. Oh. He finally has this hole to crawl into? <laughs> yeah, 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 that hole is yeah. yeah. Crawl. The VTuber hole. <laughs> I mean, didn't, that didn't hole like the Japanese deep. voice of Sonic also did some VTubing recently? He did, well, yeah. Official? Was he? Yeah, wasn't that, wasn't that an official VTuber? VTuber? I thought you said like Chucky from like Child's Play. No, oh, like God. he would fucking VTube too. <laughs> That's the thing. I was legitimately honestly to say um, Chucky e. Cheese for there, and I was like, oh, oh no, nice. Child's Play, fuck. <laughs> oh no, Chucky e. you... Cheese actually did a VTube. Did, uh, oh, did you know that Chucky e. Cheese made a whole fucking music album? That is all about how COVID is totally over, guys. Oh, hey, John, that's why they're out of business. Wow. <laughs> I it, am okay, he's like, completely serious. It's Chucky, oh, like, oh, and oh, here's oh. my special guest, the ultimate warrior. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just, but for the sake of everybody's himself. sanity, we have muted his mic. <laughs> <laughs> Man, what the fuck was WCW back in the 90s? I have no idea. We were too young. Well, well, Robo, I mean, I mean, it all started with Robocop helping Sting. <laughs> uh, we, and then we also had the Glacier, who was a... Not That's right, a... it was just not Sub-Zero. Yeah. What the fuck is going on? Oh, you get used to it. Yeah. This yeah. is a typical Wednesday stream. Typical yep. Wednesday stream. And I'm actually here for one of these. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Sonia, yeah, I can be thinking you mean Chucky, not Chunky. <laughs> Chunk no, 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 Ch Chunky versus Rick Steiner. Chunky. He's dead. Yeah, no, it was like, my favorite character from Bride of Chucky was Chunky. <laughs> no, Chunky, Chunky Kong. Kong. Yeah. <laughs> you challenge me. You and your Chunky fat ass. We have to go back up here. You like Did that, someone wouldn't draw you, Ricky? Chunky Kong with a knife. I don't want to know. We already got that lore. Chunky we are Kong missing one you. Chozo lore. I remember <laughs> which knife. one it was, though. It's in the Macro Pool. Don't worry. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. The, the only room we haven't visited yet, basically. Then there's enough. Chunky. He's dead. Yeah, do we just need to power bomb the floor in here to expose a hidden half pipe? Oh right. Uh, where is it? It's uh, right underneath the magnetic rail, sir. Oh yeah, oh. AEW is happening. It's Wednesday. The root beer? No, it's Wednesday. That's, that's A N W. Oh oh, my bad. Yeah, I prefer a um. Ah oh, shit, it wasn't even that root beer. A N W. Hear that? Uh. No, it wasn't A N W. Punk. It... You hear that? Uh, C M Punk might be going to uh, A E W. Yeah. Um, I, I might be picking up A&W, uh, uh, you know, because I've been terrible about it over the last two years. Did I scan these things? I don't think I did. I can yes, get them on the did. Did I? Okay. To be fair, wrestling in the pandemic times has not been good for anybody. That's why I stopped watching WWE. I thought their COVID practices were so shitty that I unsubscribed from the network and now they're part of Peacock, and that's a that's a thing. <laughs> yeah, uh, P. <laughs> Challenge pissing. Uh, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> I love the video of that Swedish man losing his shit over mug root beer. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 it is mug root beer. I haven't seen that video, send it to me. And you can double scan them if you want to once you play your mess expansion. Are you talking about when Joel basically drunk uh, mug root yep. beer for once? <laughs> oh, okay, it's it's a Joel video, yep. all right. <laughs> Peacock, the friend of P Dan. <laughs> Yeah, I really wish I could watch more Joel streams, but he just uh, what? <laughs> too late at night. I, or too I late never the oh, catch okay. his streams live. I always watch him in post. How often does like streamers like Maximilian dude stream? Because every time I go on like Twitch for a split second, I see him on front page, and it's like two o'clock in the I, fucking morning. I think he, he, he's super like, late. He's like four or five. But he's also times full a time. Week. Like he's always yeah. he's full time. That's kind of like, yeah, like his source of revenue. So his, yeah, and he streams for like eight or nine hours oh, every man. time. That 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 is super full time. Holy shit! Hey, if you're and, and he's uh, a dad too, so like. Well yeah, but if you're up hour. at that time to watch, you you have money to pay. <laughs> yeah, I, gu I guess so. Coolest one that he has to do a 17-hour sunshine run for the amateur. Yeah, um, yeah. I'm looking. I'm looking at his Twitch page, and he it looks like he streams literally every day. I I wish that I can have a comfortability to stream like that much. 
I don't think I would have the emotional energy to stream that much. Yeah, yeah no. <laughs> remember, remember, he also just in the stream, he does a shit ton of YouTube videos, too. Yeah. Yeah, he does. Well, a lot well, of his probably YouTube pass that videos, to editor, yeah. Yeah, a lot oh, of his YouTube videos That's are, fine. like, clipped Yeah, from stuff the from the stream uh, and stuff like that nowadays. Which is fine. It, it's not just all, like, gameplay highlights. Like, he actually covers topics and shit and then uploads yeah. those to his YouTube. Next stop, and, uh, and now he's trying to bring hole. back Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Let's hope that yeah, they are yeah. 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 doves. Oh, I went the wrong way. I got the other way. So we need to go back to where we got the charge beam. There's three missile expansions that way. Yeah, true. Matt, to answer your question, One we're talking about Sam and Matt. And two in the room you haven't explored. Oh man, but uh, I would love to like be able be able to stream that much as well as basically stream whenever, especially late at night. But uh, who the fuck is texting me? Me, pick up. I mean, I can. I have your number. No, it's just PlayStation Maybe having a cell right there. now. <laughs> no, uh, but it, that is basically the dream job I'm basically going for. But yeah. now that we got someone new hired on, hopefully I can stream a lot more. Because I want to start my project this year. <laughs> I would stream that often if I made money. I, I've um, decided I cannot solo stream. But like, oh, yeah, like, I, like I, I keep trying to solo stream, and it's just like I can't. I have a hard time holding a conversation with myself, yeah. kind of deal. Yeah. For me, like, I need if I'm gonna solo stream, I basically need to stream something that I know will have an active chat. Yeah. Like, no, I'm not lonely enough to talk to myself as a professional. Yeah. <laughs> I already do I'm that enough. On I, can, I can do that with a script, but not, not directly. <laughs> Wait a minute, am I that lonely? <laughs> Um, yes. I used to just chatting to myself on there, and hell, it was that train of thought that gave us the um, custom intro to Hotel Mario. Dude, I found uh, the uh, intro cutscene to Hotel Mario on Beat Saber. It's pretty good. <laughs> I did one for the um, charity event. What, Beat Saber? No, the Hotel Mario intro. Okay. <laughs> You just like, remade the Mario intro? <laughs> yeah, I just stripped the vocals out, and it's just like, okay, I've got 20 minutes before Lost Level starts, we've got one take of this, don't like the script, just improv it and time and hope to god we get it right. <laughs> and as it turns out, we more or less got it. Uh, it's in the water here underneath. Yeah. Dear pesky streamers. Dear pesky streamers. TCR and I have taken over the mush the land of Twitch. Sam Call Me Chani is now a permanent member of my Sunshine 100% runs. I dare you to save him if you can. How the fuck do I still remember that? You, you sound like Irvin from Resident Evil 5. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, the only Hotel Mario thing I I'm have is... I'm a Twitch is streamer with standards! A, uh, a transparent GIF version of the, uh, of the intro. Oh, I love that! <laughs> um, we need to go back to that room. There's a room we haven't explored. Hey, is that the, the oh, Kaboom awesome. guy? Where's the, yeah. the earth-shattering kaboom? No, no, Irvin. Uh, Chaos Alex, as long as sponsors keep paying my bills, uh, I will keep doing sponsors. <laughs> yeah. yeah! I keep, uh, I, uh, every time I, I do the sponsors thing, like, that, that's me deliberately putting on my video because they pay my bills. I'm sorry, I just can't live off you rad revenue alone because it's always pissy. That, uh, that adorable cat tree that we posted today, that was paid for by Raycon. <laughs> <laughs> and viewers yeah. like you. Thank and you. viewers, and like, viewers you. like you, yes. Uh, Thank well, you yeah, for giving me this expensive meal today. Access uh, yeah, the charge yeah, was. Yeah, and honestly, if you're really bothered uh, by them, nothing's stopping you from just hitting the skip. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I, I was trying to debate on what the co the comment I was going to put on the video for, you know, just to, to give engagement. What was I was going to be of like, like, wait, hold on. CD, the game with amazing music, doesn't get the Raycon ad. Yeah. But Sonic Four with. That soundtrack gets the Raycon Adam. Fuck yeah, it is. Like, I love Meow Mix. Meow, 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 meow. That is not what I meant to spawn. I like chicken. I like liver. Meow Mix, meow Mix, please deliver. No. You can read my thoughts, boy. That's what I think of that. I think of that too, experiment. But my thing is, like, um, as long as the product that's being shown isn't like a That's super scummy scam like people just need to understand like hey it's good money like, yeah. like i always money. do it of like of you know for whenever i get stuff for like either games people want to show off or like random youtube ads i'll only accept the ones i feel like my audience will actually you know 
use kind of deal. Can I, uh, yeah, so you, can, I, um, can I ask about something though? Because I noticed uh, this is the second time I've seen this mentioned, but uh, Luna Paradise in the chat is mentioning something called YouTube Advanced. It skips them for you. I'm assuming it's a plugin yeah. that skips the first it's... 50 seconds of a video. No, um, YouTube no. Advanced is a custom version of the Android app. Right. That basically hacks the damn thing and just goes, hey, you want ad block? Sure. Oh, you want to be able to skip any sponsors? Yeah, sure. We'll try and I'm find it. I'm guessing that it uses like some kind of detection system in the video. Um, um, it can, or people can do it manually on an actual like desktop. I've got a special plugin that just does that for me automatically. I mean, makes sense depending on like what uh what sponsor it is. They usually aren't you forced to put like a specific like image or something like that sometimes you can uh, if no. you want to you, you don't have to but uh, they, I, i'm sure that the system it. isn't perfect if they did like a um like a community driven thing where it's like you report the ad segment and then it implements it yeah um i i don't see the point i don't get annoyed by them that much and usually like i'll just watch them to support the YouTube like my thing. only stipulation is i don't do mid rolls uh i hate throwing sponsors in the middle of the video like i, I don't yeah. like that because it disrupts the entire flow of the video yeah, Man, dude, that's the beginning or end. Again, I don't think anything will be as bad as watching a crime story about like murders at a yogurt shop being sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. <laughs> uh, let's see, we need to now go, we need to to go into the, the heating room. Yeah. Yep, the Ruin Fountain, which has a missile expansion, and it's onto the magnet board with uh, a power bomb, a final chozo or a missile, the last energy tank, and that'll take us back to the main hub with another missile expansion or two waiting for us. Uh, did oh, I wasn't it the, the Android here? app with no, the I YouTube thing? He didn't, because we yeah. need Spider Ball. Yeah, we need Spider Ball. Um, I've gotten offers for sponsorships. I, I I don't feel comfortable taking them yet, but I know someday I'll probably be at the point. Where I think the hard. scariest thing about getting those kind of emails, because I get them a lot, is you know, they ask you for a rate. I was like, I put $10. <laughs> I don't fucking know. $10 <laughs> and a free wallet. How much do you think you're worth? <laughs> oh, it's like filling out a job application. They're like, yeah. so, how much do you think you should be paid? And it's like, uh... You better say minimum wage, you motherfucker. <laughs> Where's the uh, secret? Night. Is there a secret tunnel around here somewhere? It's the next room. It's the room after this. Room. Okay, I'm thinking of the other It's like right before the door. Cheeky bastards. Man, that's actually one thing I need to start doing is I've been getting... Uh, uh, sponsors from like the other like indie groups and stuff like that one that just wants me to play their game for like streams and stuff like that. But I'm sitting there going, I don't usually play these sorts of games. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, yeah like I keep getting like top down RTSs like all the time, and it's like what, nothing on my channel res like remotely resembles that at yeah. all. Dude, speaking of RTSs, I'm gonna change the subject real quick. Um. I was on a. Go ahead, try. I was on an escapade to basically get every Transformers game I could get my hand on, um, and usually Transformers games are action games, uh, maybe like Sandbox. Uh, this one I got for the 3DS is a fucking top-down RTS akin to Fire Emblem. Isn't it the one where it basically has like the uh, Optimus Prime just like looking at Bumblebee and the camera just shifts to Bumblebee? No, no, that was a different one. Oh, okay. <laughs> um. But yeah, it's a fucking it's Fire a Emblem Transformers yeah. game, and it's wild to me. Secret tunnel. And it, it was made by WayForward. Secret tunnel. Mouth Wait, there. WayForward actually made a Yeah, RTS it was game? it was WayForward's Transformers RTS. That was so <laughs> People forget that WayForward actually does a pretty decent amount of like third party license games. Of, yeah, uh, I think that's how they make. Yeah. I think that's how they make their real bucks. Well, for a time, that's how they made their real money because yeah, their nowadays are, they can self-publish yeah. their own stuff. Yeah, now, but back but then, fucking you, Shantae. Oh no, sorry, like uh, not, not RTS. It. I should clarify, not RTS. Uh, turn-based uh, strategy. Oh, okay. That, that's an error on my part. Thank you. You're Chad. fine. I, I'll allow you one. Oh, uh, you I guys watched the, the Nindies that happened today? Uh, I caught most of it as background noise. I was only half paying attention, though. Uh, didn't catch it. Wait, what's going on? Oh, the, just the uh, Nindies presentation. Nindies presentation. Your bomb rush is coming to Switch. That's nice. Yeah, yeah that's I, a, I, uh, that. I think a uh, console exclusive for a time, I believe. Uh, times exclusive, yeah. Yeah, times exclusive, yeah. I'm just gonna nod my head, just say, okay. <laughs> I know <laughs> these words. I'm How about instead of like, nodding your head, you ask questions to stop being a bitch? <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad we finally got actual gameplay of Bomb Rush. It's okay. I, it's just a clear party, man. Uh, I know the mechanics, right? I know, uh... <laughs> John. <laughs> Yo. 
you mentioned that, but like I I've gotten on the Cheyenne about that multiple times, where I will oh, say mean? something, and she's like, yeah, I, she's like, yeah, I totally get it. I'm like, do you though? I don't. No, care. no, I don't. I'm just saying. Yeah, it's like, then if, just say. If I was gonna say, don't. it's like if I'm at a point where it's like I'm nodding my head and agreeing, but it's also like yeah, if I'm really curious, I'll ask a question about it. <laughs> you know, it's like. I feel like the only people I do that with are family members because I don't want to upset them. I, I do it at work all the time because uh, sometimes customers will ask you things and they like they expect that you understand what they're talking about. And it's like, mm-hmm, I get it. Well, yes. that's the issue with her is that for even if she does know, it's the same kind of response. But if she doesn't follow up, I know that she doesn't know. <laughs> <laughs> And every empty tank. Every tank. Do it again. Still, yeah, Chad. Let's I still go. don't know how to feel about uh, metal slug tic tacs. <laughs> I do this all the time. I, actually, it's a good trip, but... That is a game that I am excited for, but it's also like, oh right, uh. SNK is owned by the Saudi prince who did the big murder now. So it's like, mm, what the fuck, really? Yeah. yeah. I, what? Uh, I didn't know about that. Uh, he context? is the largest majority. All right, you remember the stuff a couple years ago about the uh, the reporter who yeah, got murdered in the murder consulate. Crowd. I do remember. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, really? The Saudi so. prince who ordered that murder is now the largest shareholder in SNK. What the fuck? Oh, uh, dude, really liked Battle Fist. I forget the name of the series. He was just a really big fan of King of Fighters. There we go, thank you. <laughs> That's a big yikes for me. Anyway, yeah. here's the weather. <laughs> it's hot as balls outside. Thank you. Yeah, the, the old Are SNK you responsible? In... What are you, the fucking heat miser? <laughs> like, yeah, also that hard. SNK, in its original form, died in like the mid 2000s because of. Um... Like, they, shall they... we say less return of investments on the Neo Geo platform? And yeah, the failure yeah. of the hype on Neo Geo. I, I mean, my dad had a Neo Geo growing up, and like, it was Did basically a fucking arcade machine in your house with everything that entailed. It is. It has the exact same chips as the MVS. The only difference is the cartridge slot. I mean, that was the selling point of it, right? Yep, yeah, but it was also like. It was a thousand dollars for the console. Yeah. It was seven hundred and fifty dollars back then. Nowadays, uh, you're lucky enough to find one used for that kind of price. Yeah. Now say it with me, kids. <laughs> SNK had a hard transition to 3D. <laughs> I mean, actually, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> Play Samurai Showdown '64 sometime, and then you will immediately understand why the only character who comes back is the one everyone thinks is sexy. Well, what about the, the SNK made uh, Street Fighter game where they just have random Street Fighter uh, characters from different games, including their mechanics from those said games? Yeah. Okay, Wave Buster? Uh, yeah, we have to go with Webster. That is over in. To the, the west of yes. The, yeah, up to the west of Where you right. first got the. Uh, right, 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 right. And there's two missile expansions in the room with the Morph Ball. How much more you guys got left uh, left in this game? We're almost done, actually, with clean up. We're on final. We have to head back to the space part HQ though to get a lore that I missed. Which yep. game was the? Uh, because Matt did a video on it recently. Uh, Capcom fighting fight jam and all stars. Uh, so yeah, one. there we go. Uh, though to be fair, their uh, 2D Capcom offering wasn't that great either. Who no, not really. The <laughs> chaos, boy, we what? sure. We sure oh, okay. do love the whole cast of nothing but Shodos. Oh, come on, Nora. It's not that bad. It's not like the bosses are actually impossible to beat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway, here's Ryu. <laughs> Anyways, here's Ryu like three times. Oh, come on. You have Ryu, yeah. Ken, Violent Ken, Evil Ryu, Akuma, Shin Akuma. Oh, I see what you mean. Uh, what was the, uh, was the Evil Ryu? Kage, was it? Is that already? No, no, it was just Evil Ryu. Just Evil yeah. Ryu? Yeah, she, I thought, because I thought, there was also Kage, though. Kage was also just like the manifestation of Evil Ryu's. Uh, oh, uh, don't forget Asura. No, I was just talking about the I was just talking about the characters in Capcom uh, S and SBC Chaos. Oh, oh, God. oh, Christ. Yeah. Crap, what was the name <laughs> of that oh, one like, game where it's just nothing but QTEs? Oh, uh, Azor's Wrath. Azor's Wrath. Azor's Wrath. 
Yes, I can. Oh, Rap, where if you want the ending, you gotta buy it That's in the right, DLC. That's right, you need DLC. Oh my god, I, I really mean, don't want to have to kill these ghosts. I mean, the best of Shura's Wrath DLC was the Street Fighter DLC. Oh yeah, where you basically just see, like, you uh, you him fighting. No, you <laughs> yeah, you literally just play Street Fighter 4. I still love the indie like game so much because it's just like, hey, do you accept my offer? And you just like punch the fucker out of his face. Though, is buying deal buying DLC to get the the ending of a game any worse than having to buy the pre order collections edition for the ending of a game? Which game? Looking at you, that? Metal Gear Solid Five. Which game? Oh that? no! Metal Gear Solid Five. All right. Oh. <laughs> All right. With the development. <laughs> videos. Thanks, Genius Jason. Kajumbo. Jason, it wasn't just a pre-order bonus. You had to buy the collector's edition. <laughs> and yes, I, that from here. <laughs> I did that. And I have a tiny little prosthetic arm to prove it. <laughs> I put it on. <laughs> That's how we learned about Lord of the Flies. <laughs> Yay! That all the shows are fat are, 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 are. One left. <laughs> okay. One. The things. One more I play a, uh, Look, Chet, you can you can judge me about my weird purchase of Metal Gear Solid. I have bought so much weird shit from like merchandise. It's not even funny. How many copies of Metal Gear Solid Two you got right now? I think I have a thirteen. I Holy say. shit! I feel like I should introduce you to a dude I know who is like a therapist. <laughs> <laughs> no, not a therapist. This no, there's this guy in another fucking. Puffers. Yeah, the plate of puffers. An another Discord I'm in who fucking every time he he has bought so many copies of various DMC and Metal Gear games because he wants to get all of his friends into them. I, I mean, it's not just 13 copies of MGS2, it's 13 different versions of MGS2. <laughs> even better. I didn't even know there were that many versions. I mean, it's literally one version of MGS2 and like 90 different versions of Substance. <laughs> So what is the demo? Oh, the Zone the Ender's demo? Yeah, I have that. That's how I first experienced it. Isn't that just a tanker chapter? Yeah, and that's it? it's just tanker. Yeah. yeah, it's up to the Olga fight and that's it. Oh, just Olga? Yeah. yeah. So, oh yeah, Zone of the Ender's is 20 years now. Oh my yep. god, holy shit. Holy shit. And I'll tell you right now, that dub has aged like fine wine. <laughs> <laughs> If said fine wine was transported to a parallel universe where everything was rotten milk. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh. holy shit, that dub. Was Zone of the Enders any good? Well, I got a Game Boy game, so I think so. Um, Zone of uh, the Enders 1, you can give or take. Zoe 2, though, yes. Yeah, There's a reason Zoe that's the only one they bring back. You mean Zoe 2 and Zoe 2 HD, not Mars. Yo, shout out to this fucking obnoxious... Oh my god, the sun! Oh, honest, ah, JJ Abrams, go away! <laughs> Mars is the best version of that game. I, I thought a lot of people didn't like Mars. Hey, Trio, thank you for the Rayman Party of 4. 4K VR if you really want it, but it just runs and looks beautiful. What I kindly want. Hey, Trio, congratulations on finishing Bioshock. Yeah, we oh. finished Bioshock! Oh, the original? Yep. Yeah. Would you see it on the channel? Well, well, well re remastered, but yeah. Ready to Boston, Boston, over at the end of the game. Boston, 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 Hashtag would you kindly. An invisible man sleeping, sleeping in your bed. Your bed. <laughs> Who are you gonna Let call? Something. Cops! <laughs> Freaky okay, so ghost bed! Now we need to go towards the hive Freaky mecha. Freaky ghost man! Yeah. Freaky ghost baby! Because we missed a missile expansion in the ruined gallery. Which one? We're all alone. Oh, the one in the morph ball tunnel? Yep, you missed it. Yeah, okay, I guess I just didn't get it. When you're all alone. Let me sleep in your bed. Your bed. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? What are you referencing? Because I don't know what you're really talking about. Wait, you never seen Bustin? <laughs> no, I never no. seen Bustin. Oh my god. Bustin, Bustin, Bustin. I got it, I got it, I got it. I just repeat it because you guys are always saying it, so. Yeah, that's how memes work, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. the memes, Jack. Osmosis. Uh, the meme. I am. I am so sad that they changed the term from memes in uh, the the, t the world ends with you sequel. Hey. And I don't remember Jason. what it's called now because I don't have yeah. a game yet. But like, uh, Jason, if you do the honors, please. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, will this get the stream? Give me a sec. It depends oh. on how derivative it is. If it's if it it's, is, if it's if it's if it's a Ray Parker song, I'm gonna put a veto on that. It is it is very derivative of the Ray Parker song. Then I don't want to. Yeah, risk that's it. what I was like. I'm like looking for Play like that. the <laughs> best three seconds. <laughs> yeah, just just search for. Yeah, small snippets. Oh yeah, you can make clips now, right? Hmm? You can make clips now on uh, YouTube, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. They're not yeah. the same. It was uh, popular enough, I believe. Like uh... it. It's okay. basically just the right, same as sharing a video with the time code. Just need uh, that. Okay. Shows a lot of fact, and ruin should be clean. Yeah, let's head back to Flogger then. Uh, did we get it's... everything from that spider ball tower with the cordite in the bottom? Did we go there? Uh, spider ball with the cordite. You mean the Prendrana? No, 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 in Chosen Ruins. You know the, right the, 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 the vertical the tower with the spider ball tracks? I, I thought there was a Cordite planning in there, too. Um, um, the one where we got two missile expansions, you mean? I believe so. Hold on, I'm heading back there anyway, so we're gonna find out. Because if you remember which room there's on the map, I can probably just tell you. Um... Because we can't go back this way. It is um, it's 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 how you uh, it's how you exit out of Flagra. Oh um, the Tower of Light. They've already done that one. If you mean that way out, we have to go back that way. Because we can't go this way because there's vines blocking the door. Right, because right. All right, so we have to go the other way. All right, so we have to go via Hive Mecca. Oh shit! Then I'll go that way then. But yeah. Um. In that area, there's nothing, oh, just the two shows I wore, which you've already got. Okay, I wasn't sure if there was like a cordite plating that, that had a this... missile expansion. Oh no, there's two cordite platings in there, but that's for the um, nodes. Right. So, okay, that's what I was thinking, towards. yeah. Then after that, the last bit should just be in Fundrana. And there should just be three missile expansions, one in Fardus's chamber, that little offshoot room, uh, the space pirate law in Research Lab Hydra, and lastly, uh, two missile expansions in Fendrana's Edge, the Frost Cave where we need the grapple beam, and the room where the gravity yeah. suit was. Yeah, we're basically almost done. Like, give it like a half About hour and we're, yeah, yeah, I was gonna say, we'll be heading to endgame. Because depending on the RNG, meta really might take 5 or 20 minutes, and we yeah. know now why. <laughs> now do it again. Now do it again. No. I mean, Mikey, if I have 5 hours and I wasn't working on the commission, I'd boot the fucking thing right up now and do it. <laughs> God, how many playthroughs have you beaten this game so far? How many playthroughs have you played so far with this game? I've done nearly 20 runs in a year alone of this. Uh, <laughs> what is after this? Well, Prime 2 and Zero Mission came out the same year. Uh, so that depends on which game came out first. I think it was. Here, Prime. I can check. I want to say it's Prime 2. I'm checking right now. Let me sleep in the old day. <laughs> I just want everyone to know Diego is no, in my Jason. lap. Uh, zero, zero Mission came out first. Okay, then yeah. we're doing Zero Woo! Mission. First. Now, are we doing the uh, intended speedrun route or are we just going to go. Uh... Let's just scan my panels. Yeah, it's gonna take so I'm tired. Super, super, super cute <laughs> I wish I had a cat. Me oh, too. On, hey, I no, you know. the shelter. Like over time I think I want to have an attempt at like having another cat, but like I would really have to train it to be an indoor cat, uh would be the thing. We just gotta yeah. get him young and just never take him outside. Yeah. Yeah. You got yeah, Diego tried to make perfect. a run for it the other day. Oh my god. Uh, like I was telling Nora, like, I was waiting for her to get home last night, and it's like I was. I wasn't sure when she was getting back, so I was just I was hanging on the couch for like half an hour. It's like, I don't know when she's getting back, and I gotta keep an eye on him. So now we just have to. Uh, uh, where's the other the, the pillars? Other two, the pillars yeah. Yeah. All right, the Sonic Happy Contest 2021 events. I could probably do something with that this year because I've got hardware access now. Oh, like showcase some stuff yourself? Yeah, I've got. Not one, but two flash cards for it, and I've got Sega CD and 32X access. Oh, awesome. Nice. Where's that last one at? Is that a it's on, like, one of the back of the pillars. Yes, yeah, there is. you are. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I just saw Jet. Yeah, just... yeah, Zero Mission is a one session. Especially if we do the intended um, sequence breaks. Oh, you're not going to oh, go for like doing Ridley first? 
Yep, that makes it so much quicker. Yeah, I think we will be doing Ridley first. Because it's really not that hard. Nah, it's a piece of piss. Ah, oh, John, piece I'm surprised that piss. you haven't seen that video at all. No, not at all. It's a load of piss. He's the guy that also made the uh, world's longest Yahoo ever. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> yeah, kind of like that. Uh, whatever. Oh, fuck. Okay. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay, Snake. I'm talking to the enemy, not you. Oh! <laughs> Oh yeah, speaking of Sonic Cake and Contest. Hey Donnie. Cancel. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> how short how short is zero mission if you're doing any percent? It's sub fifty minutes if you know what you're doing. Yeah, a hundred percent no. No, hundred percent, maybe two hours tops. Yeah, yeah. I'm not be I won't be it, it's still gonna be a one session game, but I'm not gonna be doing it like fucking sub fifty minutes. No, because I did that for Metro United, and I was doing nearly two to three runs a day for that one. No, no, thank you. So yeah, this, this is canonically where you're supposed to canonically fucking. This is where you're supposed the to show the ghost the first time. If you really know what Whoa. you're doing, you can. Depending on when you fall down that shaft for the first time, is what triggers the event set up for this. Yeah. And you can basically just ping yourself back up here and get this early, but uh, set up. <laughs> Leave this off for the bo for the boss fight. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's just what no one really can do. When he's doing bombing sweeps. <laughs> Man, I did not know the chosen who's like the Yahoo a lot. He's <laughs> like the longest yeah boy. We have returned from our ascension <laughs> to some sort of interdimensional heaven to give you our Yahoo. You have yeed your last whore, boy. <laughs> But I, I just love that that song on the album because it's just him doing that, and he gets progressively longer and longer. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah the, the whole yeah boy just kind of reminds me back from the uh, Mario thing from last week where we were playing pinball, and you, and I, I just remember just like naming out some random better pinball games at that point. I beat the boss. I'm like, yeah boy! <laughs> yeah boy! <laughs> I was just so happy, and the die just lost it right then and there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, John, I have good news. Mm. Uh, the stink mist seems to be doing its job. Oh, awesome. Diego tried to bite the uh, the land cable just now. Yeah. And then immediately was like, <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> um, using something that shit don't to, um... <laughs> Yeah, uh, don't use a uh, like a, a water gun, okay? No. Nah. Wait, you could just put like some like gross shit on it, and they. Yep. If yeah. you want it, if you want it done on the cheap, use anything that's citrusy. Yeah, because uh, cats don't like citrus. It's too powerful for their senses. Oh, artifacts collected. All right, there's nothing Ooh. in the flower bed, is there? Which makes me wonder why they don't just coat stuff in that already. Just gotta go to Funjana now. I mean, they the put it on your Switch cartridge. cartridge. Right. Well, no, that's a bitter substance. It's the most bitter substance we could find on a chemical level, and even then, I've tried some of that stuff. It ain't nothing to me. That's just but weird. is it nothing to a cat? Um, well, let's see. If it's overly bitter for a human, let's see how bitter it is to a cat who have higher senses than us. I don't want to try Do that. Do they have higher senses than us when it comes down to their tongue? I'm pretty I sure they have a higher so. sense of hearing and a sense and of taste. sight, too. No, yeah. no. And taste hearing, a, taste? hearing and maybe sight, maybe I can guess, but... Where's the fan? Uh, uh, smelling, too, because cat, cats recognize no, no, each other. Uh, the, 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 the fastest route to the fan Oh, yeah, yeah, cats, um, they're all, like, pheromone like marking and all that jazz. That goes to but I don't think they'd have a higher sense of taste. And if they do, that's a horrible existence of them having to lick their own buttholes all the time. <laughs> Close your eyes and you can't taste it. <laughs> My, my cat keeps sitting on my desk and just staring at me. Oh, piss, man. Dude, wants God damn. She wants to kill you. Yeah, she probably does, but then I pet her and then she's happy. <laughs> you just encourage that behavior. Yeah, I just live another day. Thankfully, since Diego moved in, Celine has stopped trying to sit on my fucking mouse while I'm using it. <laughs> Uh, however, the flip side is Diego keeps turning off the computer. Oh no! Little shit. <laughs> what is he what hitting? Is he uh, hitting the power button? He's power... he's hitting the fucking power strip. Oh. Because oh. I, I ha you know that box I have under the other desk? Yeah, I do. I have it behind there, but somehow he's managed to wedge his little foot under there and hit it. 
Fuck you, pay attention to me. <laughs> I'm better than that computer of yours. <laughs> Come on, you're just looking at cat photos. I'm an actual cat. <laughs> That's what I worry about with Cinder is just... He's going on two in November, I think. And we just keep running into issues with him bullying Naki. And oh, Naki no. turns like 11 this year. <laughs> Selene and Diego are doing okay. Um, she still, like, won't let him get too close. But it's also, like, she's not hissing at him. No. Uh, day she just, one, she was good. hissing. Yeah. Uh, but that kind of, uh, that, they kind of mellowed out pretty fast after about a week's time. What are we missing? Uh, and, and someone um, asks, you named your cat Cinder? Yes. Oh, I was like, oh, uh, so I didn't pick the name for Cinder. Cheyenne did. And uh, that was at the time that we still thought that Cinder was a girl cat. Um, and then a few months later, we realized, oh, no. Oh, no, he's not. <laughs> no, that's a penis. But, uh, that's a penis. Sh she decided to give Cinder that name because she's a major Spyro fan. I knew uh, it was going to be that. It's better than the alternative. I thought it was a Ruby reference. I named my cat after a part of pants, so. What's your cat's name? Zippers. Zippers. Oh, that's cute. Oz was... Oh, just, just, add the, just add the word men and it's a JoJo reference. There you go. Oz was Leo, but because he gained so much weight and he was such a dumbbell, we just used to call him the fat man. Oh, I thought you meant like it was just Leo because he was so fat, we just named him Lion because he's so big. Yeah, he was. It, that's where we took it from, Lion is in big. But. He was taken from his parents way too early, so we had to manually train him for everything. Uh, and the problem was, he wasn't a very bright spark no, to begin with. We will learn how to kill. What's that kill? <gasps> All of my mom's cats were named after, like, rejected baby names for me, and every time, <laughs> like... Wow. Go, Secretary! Oh! <laughs> Go, see this kid. It's one of those things where it's like, all right, of of the choices, I'm glad you went with this one because I don't think I could have lived with any of the others. <laughs> also, you were thinking of calling me what? <laughs> <laughs> I, I I don't know if I, there were any other names that I was planning on being called. I, I think from the get go, they just like yeah, my father's name is Juan. Let's just call him Juan. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> um, I was You'll get a better name later on down the road. <laughs> uh, ours was shared with Grandpappy, because I'm technically the third and now last of the line. It's just, yeah, maybe he'll be the uh, just like you. With me. Mine hopefully, wasn't Hopefully it'll just greatest. be like you, and then university we... happens, it's like, oh, uh, we oh got, uh, this yeah. went horribly right. Yeah. <laughs> Mine was of the greatest intentions, and I don't like it. <laughs> So we can either go to the first entrance and go through that way, all the way through from John, or we can go straight to the end and go through Fardus' entrance. Let's go to the first entrance of from John, why not? That way we get both music tracks. True. Uh -huh. uh -huh. So, uh, what type of person do you think uh -huh. of whenever you first hear my name? Uh, uh, Jason? Yes. Jason? Wait, the first person when I think of, I think of Jason? Uh, Jason Boyd. No, Jason. no, no, like, what's the first <laughs> sort of appearance that you think of whenever you hear that name? Oh, just like, who I expect that Jason to look like? Yes. Hey, Jason? I, I can't put a figure it, or a face on it. Especially whenever you get down to, like, my full name, Jason Tyler Henry. <laughs> is the joke that you have a white name? Yeah. Like really? I never took Jason yeah. as white. Yeah. That's thing. interesting, yeah, because I never took Jason as white. Uh, yeah, it's, hey, Jason's pretty generic, like me. Or, yeah, like Justin as well. Yeah. Like Justin, Jason... John, Juan, and those are all pretty yeah, fucking never, standard I, names. I never took Jason as a, like, distinctly, like, black name or anything like that, so... Mm -hmm. That's a boring name. Can we all agree with that? Chad? I don't know any Chad. I don't think I don't know any Chad. Maybe they're nicknamed Chad? If I only hear Chad as, like... I, I had in, a boss. I had a terms. boss that was named him, uh, but that's a... I, I've never known a, a legit Chad. I did, and I fucking hated his ass. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, kind of the Chad. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah, anytime I do meet one that does have that, they end up kind of being an asshole. So. Oh yeah, it's the Chadster. <laughs> yeah, go. Do they hate virgins? <laughs> <laughs> 
So, um, my dad's name was Juan, and I was almost named John out right. of that. Um, and then, like, at the last minute, they're like, no, let's name him David. Uh, and then somehow I became Travis, and I was, don't was know. It, how. Well, it was like all religious biblical references, basically? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, Emma, thank you for the tier one. Appreciate it. Uh, just left my job for four years. Not trying to look for a replacement job, but I had an interview today. Now I can catch a stream. Feeling all right. I mean, that's good. I mean, I'm hoping. I'm pretty. I, it's safe to assume you left your job on bad terms because it's just not working for you anymore. But I hope it does good to help with your mental facilities. John, your GPS lost signal. What? That's fine. I know where <laughs> to go from Fan Johnny, so. All I gotta exactly. go back is go back to the, uh, the the space pirate uh, and get that one lore that I missed. All right, Johnny. How well do you know Metroid Prime One for the uh, Nintendo GameCube? For the Cube? most part, really Maybe good. Steve, the thing but that I again, the thing that threw me off the most for most of these runs is that I'm doing a lot of sequence breaks I never did before. Well, you already have everything, right? Yeah, now, I have right? everything now. So now I'm just in cleanup mode. Okay. I can't believe what, I missed uh, the fucking power lore though. What more uh, do you have left? I have one more pirate lore that I have to rescan in a space pirate uh, HQ because I missed it the first run, and I think I'm missing two more missile expansions in uh, Fendrana. You got all the power bombs? I'm pretty sure I have all the power bombs, yes. Experiment. Experiment has crossed over to the other side. Rest in peace. GPS is not working is somewhat topical, though, oh. given that Google Maps is, like, dying right now. Wait, what's going on with Google Maps? Uh, Google Maps and Android Auto is completely broken oh, after the last up. update. Mm. Oh, shit. Like on Which phones or the... Andro web? on Whenever you use it on Android Auto. Wait, really? Uh, Hang on. Let me yeah. Which is funny, because you can use Waze, and that still works, and that runs off Google Maps, so... <laughs> That's concerning, because I need to use my GPS. I mean, as long as you don't run Google Maps through Android Auto, you're fine. Uh, I run it through whatever the fuck my Google Pixel is. Yeah, that's just your phone. You're oh. fine. All right. Android Auto is like the actual um, OS for some cars. Oh, that explains it. Tony, was it worth it to burn through all those missiles to burn those two guys? <laughs> yeah, I, 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 Linky, in order to burn fire, you have to burn something. Fight fire with fire. Absolutely. No. These, this Can't fire is it. missile powered. Can't make an omelet without breaking a couple nuts. <laughs> what? Where's everybody going? <laughs> Hello? I feel pain. Ah, uh, Diego, this is my hand. So does Nora feels pain, but that's different. <laughs> I do. Making I do the feel mother pain. of all nuts, Jack. <laughs> is, uh, is Diego a two sock cat? No, <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> That's the term. <laughs> okay, maybe that term isn't as well known as I thought. Um, <laughs> what? Uh, Please explain. That... I don't want to now. <laughs> no, you gotta explain. Yeah, I think you have um, to explain now. You you, no, you, yeah, you made I, this bed. You gotta lay it up. Um, no, uh, it was a term that we would use for how many socks you would have to put on your hand to play with the cat. Oh, I see. Uh, no, That's Celine. The kitty. <laughs> Celine's a two sock cat. <laughs> oh, okay. Kitty, yeah, kitty. I... Pet the kitty. <laughs> I remember when I spent some time with Celine and I had so many cuts on my hands afterwards. <laughs> yeah, because yeah. I didn't clip her nails for a while. Die uh, Celine, when Diego's not around, likes to hang out by my desk. And what she will do is she will just randomly attack my feet. Yes. <laughs> Aw. It's adorable. And then it. It's adorable, but it fucking hurts. It does, but, you know, tough enough. Johnny, there's blood. <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> you know, Cinder's kind of the same way. We just can't clip him, unfortunately, because he, uh, he'd move around too much. And uh, he doesn't like scratch posts, either. So instead, oh, no. he digs his claws into you. And I have plenty of shirts now that are ruined because they're covered in holes from whenever he tries to climb up on me. Yeah, my... My work pants have some fresh new phrase in them, thanks to Diego, which is unfortunate. The edge. The edge is yeah, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I don't know what I did tonight. with zippers because she is very considerate and gentle. Oh. Oh, I wish Cinder was that way. He's a 
he's missing his back right leg. It's just a nub. Aww. So he digs in to climb up on anything, including oh. your shoulders. Oh no! By the way, he likes being on shoulders. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah, you could have just walked around. No, <laughs> no. There's, 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 there's an enemy over there. That's dangerous. All right. We need to. That's the space. We're going to be entering this. Yeah, we're going to be going back to the edge. Because there's a, good, there's a. No, no, no. Um, what? Dude, my cat goes nuts for fucking ping pong balls. Like, uh, we bought a whole pack of them just for the cat. And. Sometimes in the middle of the night, we try to put them away so they don't play with them at, during the nighttime. Uh, but sometimes in the middle of the night, you'll just hear one pinging around on the kitchen floor. Hate that. Cinder's the same way. <laughs> the thing that scares the <laughs> shit out of me the most with Diego right now is that when we oh, we lock him in the bedroom and we we can't keep an eye on him, uh, occasionally I'll just hear him fuck with the door stopper. Oh, and yeah. it's oh, yeah, really yeah, yeah, yeah. fucking loud. Yeah, I've I've had that happen. It's usually by another cat that wants me into my room. I think the worst that we've had with something like that is that we, uh, we had gotten him, like, this floppy fish toy. Oh, yeah. I think I have one of those. And, um, he doesn't play with it, but randomly, in the middle of the night, he will take it and bring it into the bed. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just floppy against ah, you, like... Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I can just yeah. like Jason laying there in the middle of the night, eyes wide, and he said, "Thank you, this face." Yeah. <laughs> we we had to kick Diego out of the bedroom after the first night oh because God. it turns out Diego does not understand like people need to sleep. Yeah. So every three hours, he'd wake up. Just he'd wake us up because he was just tacking our feet, climbing all over us. Hey, I'm gonna play with your face right now. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Just, like, wake up and your whole entire face is, hey, like, I, I want you to sniff my ass. <laughs> I haven't gotten my hair cut since before the pandemic, and now Diego just thinks of it as a fun toy. Oh, of course. <laughs> like, oh, dangly thing. I'm gonna eat your earrings straight <laughs> from the ear itself. <laughs> oh, my God. Fresh pickings. <laughs> <laughs> Shiny thing. <laughs> That's why you have to watch him when you put him up on your shoulders. <laughs> oh, and uh, don't leave your glasses on the table. I think you will run I, off with them. I think today oh. I will cause problems on purpose. <laughs> uh, yeah, he, he's a he's a cat burglar. He has stolen her sister's uh, well, uh, shine sister's uh, ring before. And it oh. took a long I, while I to took find that, it. I, I took that as a cat stealing other cats. <laughs> yeah, there's definitely been stealing stuff. We don't know where yet, but he definitely has. Yeah, he's definitely hitting some shit. That's why I'm trying to break, break him from that habit. Instead of stealing stuff, I'm trying to get him to play fetch with it. <laughs> We are hoping that when Diego gets his balls chopped off, he will calm down a little bit. <laughs> but not That's what I hoped at Cinder. <laughs> Didn't it happen? No. <laughs> I used to get that slide tight, right? Yeah, I did. All right. but I, that's one of the main issues, though, is that when we got him at the time, he basically grew up alongside alongside a baby Jarvan Shepherd, so he's a bully. <laughs> uh, mm. <laughs> Whatever. <sighs> All right, Linky, what the fuck are you sending me? Picture of me getting naked. I knew uh, it. Yeah, I'm no getting naked. No nudes in the voice chat. Why not? It's not nudes. I'm just getting naked. Linky, that is at least halfway to to a nude. Ma'am, this it's just a banana. Yeah, seriously. If you just look <laughs> at the photo, it's just a photo of me getting naked. 
the epic lawsuit. Uh, oh yeah, I, I see the post now. And it sure is indeed a picture of you getting naked. Yeah. I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna try it out. <laughs> Christ, like, that's like the last thing you want to fucking say. <laughs> You've never had naked? I don't, I don't know, just like at a food buffet. Alright, um... Is that a real product? I thought it was just a meme. <laughs> no, it's, it's a real, real it's product. A, it's a real drink. Oh, really? What's it taste like? It's like Good. it's like a like vegetable drink. I'm trying to think. Oh, okay. I, I like their green flavor. Oh, is that like Not... V8? Yeah, it's no. kind of like V8. Yeah. Ugh. You don't like V8? I don't know why. I can't like keep it down. No, no, I, like honestly, I whenever I drink V8s, I can't keep that shit down. I just up chug it. I'm like, oh, I can't drink this. I'm gonna chug yeah, some asshole off. keeps punching me in the face every time I like think about it. That's me. Harder trap. Okay. Ah. Uh. All right. We. <laughs> uh, what else are we missing? I know it's a missile pack. <laughs> that that was like a mental flashbang. What the fuck, Linky? <laughs> Good, you're awake now. <laughs> hey, you're finally awake. <laughs> oh my god! Cool. You're finally so, uh, awake, huh? I, yeah, I yeah. experiment. Um, hey, sorry, I can actually start, so I'm stuck on mobile again. Oh, okay. Uh, well, so hopefully, it won't be too heavy. long like last time. This happened it's like, around the exact same time uh, last night. And, uh, I'm already livid with the ISP. They're getting a very angry phone call tomorrow morning. Oh, Jesus Christ. Please don't take it out on me, god dang it. <laughs> Jason, god dang you know, motherfucker. Yeah, I'm taking it out on you, shitty engineers. Uh, speaking of uh, Skyrim, I tried Skyrim VR last night. And uh, apparently, <laughs> yeah, you might have seen the video I posted. Um, so apparently the the intro sequence where it's like, hey, you're finally awake. Um, that whole thing, uh, it, the animations and the path that you uh, that you go on are not pre-baked. I know what I'm missing. And um, are dependent on the frame rate of the game. And because it's VR, it has a, a much higher frame rate. And so like the wagon was freaking the fuck out, like bouncing everywhere. And uh, apparently the horse that's carrying the wagon can die and stop lock the game. Oh. <laughs> and that's that's what happened when I played it in VR. My, my first experience with it. But isn't there like a, isn't the Skyrim VR official too? Yeah, it's official. Finally awake. <laughs> I did not get the missile expansion in Talon where the x-ray visor is needed. And with the plasma door. Did we not pick that up? No, I don't think we did. How do you make oh, it past the um, point? You have to turn the frame Right, you got all the ones in Pajana? I believe so. We were missing the one in the Thardis room and the one Edge. Right. I think that was the only two, right? There's three. Uh, which one was the other one? Um, there's one in the Thardis' little side chamber. The other one is in the Edge where you encountered the Hunter Metroid for the first time. The third one is in the Gravity Chamber. And then there's two more back in Talon Overworld. We get them on the way back from Magmore and it's in the Tree Hall up at the top. Yeah, because... I know for a fact I didn't get the one that with the X-ray visor and the plasma door, uh, in that one yeah. vertical shaft. I know we didn't get that one. Yeah, uh, those wait, are you so? You said there was people. where I met the Hunter Metroid? Yeah. Well, you, um, you know, hold, hold on. Let me go get this research floor that I did not get because I'm already near the fucking station. Yeah, I'm I'm said, I can't view the stream because I'm stuck on mobile, so I'm just having to guess at this point. Yeah, yeah, no, that's fine. Uh, I don't know. It's What's fine that that wasn't hard coded though. For the opening segment, it just works. It just works. Again, you guys, you guys just believe his lies, but hey, Skyrim oh. is basically perfect for modders. QuakeCon is happening soon. QuakeCon? Yeah, it's Quake -Con. um, it's software's turn to Bethesda's, basically their Microsoft? yearly, their yearly Nintendo Direct sort of thing. Uh, okay. Oh. Is Halo Infinite gonna be there? Probably not. Aww. It's usually focused on its software games, which is why I actually care about it. Uh, Does that mean we're gonna get Doom? Maybe. I hope so. Are they at least done with Doom after they finished up the DLC for uh, Doom Eternal? Um, they suggested that there's more stories to tell with it, but I wouldn't be surprised if we uh, don't see a sequel to it for a while. Doom, uh, you know, it's just basically Coom. Doom Finite. The polar opposite of Doom Eternal. Yeah, it ends. Ah, <laughs> uh, finally. Hey, Master, thank you for the honest gear. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I, um... 
wooden cog. Uh, there's QuakeCon, and I think that there's Realms Deep tomorrow, which is like a indie FPS showcase sort of deal. Interesting. What about DashCon? No, oh, that's in my closet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Where is it? Where's the um, pool party, yeah? Yeah, that's in my ball, closet. The, the ball pit? Yeah, let's get to the ball pit, boys! Jump in the pit. <laughs> Jump in the pit! Alright, who's gonna be the one to piss in the ball pit? I don't. <laughs> Challenge is I don't need a challenge piss. <laughs> Thank you, Trav. What do you want, cat? Challenge pissing. Experiment, what was the lore I missed? Um, research lab Hydra Glacial Wastes. Yeah, glacial Wastes. Uh, it's I don't on know the why, top but that... of the room. But once you said that, that weird meme was like, it's really back in general, like it's green yeah. caps and everything. Meme just fucking appeared. But you didn't have to come. You didn't have a car. Alright, Trev, you, me, challenge pissing in the ball pit. Let's go. Alright. Let us. What was the quote from JoJo? Let us partake in ritual male bonding. Open the game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a baseball! I mean, if you oh, actually want some virtual. That's baseball! F? If you actually Smager. want virtual challenge. Chargers. If you want some actual virtual challenge pissing, there's a mini game in Yakuza 2 that's a pissing mini game. Wait, oh, what? I'm not explaining. I'm leaving. Bye. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is one hesitant to start Kuwami 2. Uh, in the Sega arcade, there's a little like urinal pissing game. I'll put ten dollars on Travis winning challenge pissing. Good. Finally, someone who understands my bladder. <laughs> Yep, ISP's down, not just here, but on the mainland as well. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, who didn't configure the DNS servers again? Sorry. That guy is getting fired. Can you really call it challenge pissing if you're not pissing for like a minute and a half straight? Like Norman Reedus? Hang on, yeah. let me drink this monster energy drink, I'll tell you about 20 minutes. I mean, I've had let's nights. let like, five liters. <laughs> like, I've had nights, well, I said not nights, but mornings after, like, uh, drinking, where I will fucking piss for what seems like an eternity. Fuck yeah. Challenge. For so long, you think you're frying chicken. <laughs> Damn, boy, you frying chicken in there? Just kidding, you piss loud as fuck, baby. That's pretty cool. <laughs> What was the original the original of that meme? <laughs> I'm not sure. I saw it with the Sonic and Shadow meme. All right. Yes. Yeah, that is that Same. taken care of. Now we got to go back. I don't want to think about Sonic challenge pissing. Okay. Why not? Yeah. Where would it come from? I don't want to think about Where that. Where does it go? Where does it go? <laughs> oh, no, Joe. Does he do? All right. Uh, <laughs> just a quick refresher uh, experiment. I got. The missile expansion underneath the frozen ice because I used grapple to lock uh, to shoot down the stalagmite or stalactite. Yep. Uh, I got the one in the Thardis room with grapple beam. You said there's one more. Yeah, in the room where you encountered the Hunter Metroid for the first time. Uh, I guess that, that does that also require grapple? Yes. Okay, that's why I didn't think about it. That's gonna I've, block. I've got thunder, rain, and lightning here too. Yo, give me some. No. You know, I'm gonna save. Oh I wow, I've had 14 up this whole entire time. Don't play dumb. Rip your no. GPU, I guess. No, no, no. My GPU's fine. It's just like, yeah, uh, I got something around in the background. I looked over and I'm sitting there in Limzo right now. I'm surprised I didn't get kicked out yet. Linky, play a real man's game like Dude. World of Warcraft. Alright, uh, I'll play a real game. Let's play fucking, uh, hang on, let me think of a Steam library. I'll play Blizzard games right now. How about that? Uh, Fuda, Fuda <laughs> Dick Pick. That's a, that's a game on Steam. No, 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 no. We're gonna be playing the best game. Hang on, where the fuck is it? We're gonna play... RuneScape. Classic. I got Metroid Prime here on the left and fucking Ray Parker Jr. on the right side just staring at me. <laughs> it's kind of surreal. Almost liminal. <laughs> well, he's not just staring, he's busting. He's busting, yeah. Hey, busting! 
Boston, 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 Boston. Oh my god, I, I forgot that I still have Streets of Camaro on my uh, Steam library. Oh my god. I just fucking my, uh... bopped my head on that damn thing. Okay, now we should be back to normal. Okay, awesome. Come on, why can't we play real games on Twitch like Oni Chambora? I have no idea what that is. I'm pretty Wait, sure Oni Chambora is actually banned on Twitch. <laughs> Hold on, Let's I, find I have out. To that. Yeah, because isn't that's a Wii game also? Wait, what? What is it? Yeah, there is a Wii release as well. Okay. And it was better than its is, um, sister game. Is an action so... game. Uh, Azura Greyheart, if this is the first stream you caught live, I do apologize. <laughs> so, I tried to do some DNS hookups on the mainland and they're all down, so I just went, just try Ireland. And there you go, it worked. Well, I mean, you're back, that's all that matters. Yeah, it's not much. in the banned games list from so far from what I'm looking at. That's, yeah. yeah, what, yeah what, you all know right, what? So, I, I, I'm kind of curious. Can we get like a sampling of officially banned Twitch games from this sure. list? Uh, are you sure about that? Yeah, well, name the ones I, that are doesn't have the bad titles. <laughs> okay, 3DX Chat, Artificial Girl One, Two, and Three. Oh, oh not two. Not, uh, they really hit the stride after two. <laughs> of course, you know the Honey series, like Honey Camp Studio, Honey Pop. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can play Honey Pop too. Uh, there is a safe for work version. Whoa, Genital jousting. Point? Oh, what? Wait, General Jousting is banned? Like, it was yeah. fucking fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, it's it really surprising a game called Genital Jousting is banned. Come on now. <laughs> I have, I wonder, did they ban BMX Triple X? Yes, oh, yes, yeah. they did. Yeah, they would okay. have to. They would have to. Yandere Simulator is also that. banned. <laughs> I, I remember when that one got banned. There was so much drama. Which room is it? Uh, experiment. Oh, the um, hunt, probably the one called Hunter Cave. <laughs> Most of nah, the Sakura the series right is banned. So oh, uh, half the Frost list Cave. is the. That's the one. Okay, I'm going back. Half the list is the Sakura series, and the other half is got rape in the title. Okay. So yeah. that's the banned list. Okay, I there can't, we go. I can't believe they banned Porno Studio Tycoon. <laughs> <laughs> Porno Studio Tycoon. I feel like I've seen and heard this before. You likely have. No, I can't because Buffer I use them on Switch. Compared to some of the shit that is tame. What is Yandere Simulator? Oh boy. You don't want to know. Oh, see, because I'm not Woo! telling you this. I'll tell you when it's finished. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would just like to point out that Elden Ring was both announced and is coming out before Yandere Sim will finish. <laughs> now, here's a better question. When will, um. Oh, what's the name of the game? Uh, it's only quite clone. Ah, fuck. Names escape me now. If, uh, God damn. Wait, oh, I hate Brave Hearts. Wait, what game um, are you thinking about? It, it, was on, <laughs> it was on the Wii U. Freedom Planet. Uh, yeah, you're being that's the one, thank you. Freedom Planet 3 will have a game before Beyond Day. Freedom Planet 2. <laughs> Yeah, Freedom it's Planet 2 will two, come out. Man, we're oh, even talking. Okay, There's already on 3? Freedom Planet 3 by the time before that case gets... I'm going to be dead by the time Freedom Planet 3, 3 comes out. Shit. All right, what missile expansion? Because uh... uh, You need to take this collider over. Oh. See, the thing about Yandere Sim... That and that will show you a place you can hit a stalactite. I thought I did this already. Yeah, it's the one. It's the, uh, it's the missile underneath the, 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 the ice, right? Yeah. Yeah, I got that one already. Oh, you got that one? Yeah, cool. yeah, yeah, So the other one's in the gravity chamber, if you haven't got it. Oh, all right. What the hell is the damn gravity chamber, then? Um, gravity suit room, because I noticed that. No, 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 no I, was, I was talking to myself if I was, uh... Oh. I was looking at the map. Yeah, there it is. All right. Half-Life uh, 4 will that's come the out one before Yandere yeah. Sim. Dude, we've already seen footage of Half-Life Episode 4 before 3. Oh, shit, you're yeah, right. Okay, let's go. Cool. Now oh, here's yeah, a chalky oh, monkey no, because you're right? epic. Thank you. No problem. We still need to do that co-op uh, Half-Life 2 stream. Dude, I was there. actually thinking about that yesterday. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, that's funny you bring that up. Now um, that um, Dolphin and MGA integration is done and relatively stable, I now really, really want to push a Four Swords Adventures run. Yeah, uh, same. It, won't, it, it likely won't be anytime soon on this channel specifically, but I, I totally want to fucking do that. Oh, we gotta yes. get the band back together. Hell yeah. Uh, yeah. You gotta get Wait, the band. Uh, huh. I'm still waiting for Freedom Planet 2. By the way, don't ever comment on the release date of the game from when I hear the developers get very angry about it. I mean, when I finally get to talk about Freedom Planet 2, I'm gonna mention the fucking gap between when it was announced and when it came out. 
I'm yeah. sorry, that's well, never the bill. That's just part of the dead development history. Guys. Yeah, that's yeah. part of the development history. If they're gonna get pissy about that, that dude, that's their fucking fault. Like, uh, like I mean, that's almost like getting pissy about me asking John when the Uncharted yeah, 3 Yeah, damn right. And the more you ask, them, they, I keep telling you, the more you bring it up, the, the, I, I add another year to getting pushed back. At this point, I think you never want me to look at Uncharted 3. <laughs> so just stop fucking asking. <laughs> hey, I, I'm just pushing it back so you can do the marathon when Uncharted comes out. <laughs> Oh, oh my god, god, it's been six years? Holy shit. That's a yeah, long time for an indie game. It's been six I've... years since it was announced? Yeah, 2015. Really? Holy fuck. 2015 was six years ago? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> god, you that game like around the time the Wii U version came out. Holy fuck. <gasps> yeah, Deltarune. Chapter 2. <laughs> you know, well, listen, I, I've all... I like Toby has said, like, it's getting, like... Really, like he's had a few playtests for it, like going, and it's pretty close to being done at this point. So oh, boy, I, I, I will wait. not, I will not blame Toby for how long Delta Room Chapter Two is taking because, like, he hey, did put up that big blog post. Ceiling. He did put that big blog post out last year, just like, yeah. So I have terrible wrist problems, and that makes it hard to code. <laughs> Yeah. And also, everybody from every other station is like, Hey, Toby Fox, can you make some music for us? Hey, Toby Fox, you want to yeah. help with that? <laughs> He's yeah. been doing a lot of composing work. I mean, the, the dude was working with Nintendo for a while, and that's, that's fucking awesome. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, if anything, I would have been like, if I, if Nintendo basically would come to yeah, me and be like, Hey, you guys want to help me out with it? The ones I know he's done, he's done the Smash remix, he did uh, Little Town, uh, he did Amori stuff. Uh, he did uh, Pokemon X and Y. Oh, no, 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 sorry, no, not X and Y, uh, Sword, Sword and Shield, and Shield yeah. DLC. Providing you've got the one from Fardis' little um, cubby hole, I did. Andrana should be clean. Okay, yeah. cool, so just head to Magmore, telling the world, last two missiles. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Then I know the perfect game that he needs to do music for. What? He needs to do music for Pikmin 4, so it'll actually come out. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you just got Pikmin 3 Deluxe. Be happy with what you got. Careful, <laughs> Arlo might hear you. I'm probably <laughs> still. You know, in my look, I'm probably still on Toby Fox's my person. Fav my favorite one of that was just like a Godzilla-sized Arlo attacking Nintendo HQ. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Knowing my look, I'm still on Toby Fox's personal shit list. Isn't, oh boy! Wait, isn't Arlo what did you do? The, he's a he's the um, puppet, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, remember when uh, Delta Room first came out? Uh, yeah. What about it? Guess who was one of the first people to um, crack the security oh. and find the debug stuff? Oh. Yeah, Does he, me did this. he get pissy about it? Uh, I don't know. He might have. I was doing it just because I figured that's not, that's kind of a silly thing to get pissy. About. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't think it. I don't think it's the case because given that we live in an age where everything is fucking ripped apart for the sake of a game theory. <laughs> um, well, uh, well, John, you say that, but uh, that's the whole reason why we didn't get a story mode for the longest time in Smash again. <laughs> For what it's worth, Undertale had a bunch of stuff in it, like that he clearly expected people to data mine the game. And oh find. yeah, the, the whole Gaster thing. Not only just the Gaster thing, like the original releases of Undertale, there was a sound file that was like, "Hey, I know you're hacking my." Oh, game. I know. Oh yeah. Just it's, don't um... rights until like a certain amount of time after the game's passed. Yeah, well that's understandable. But I like when they have, like take the piss out of it. I mean, there was also a file in there that says, hey, please don't put these uh, sprites on TSR, the sprite is resource. Guess what happened anyway? Yeah. Yep. It probably so anyway, also doesn't help, that there's, it doesn't help that there's no protection at all on Undertale's um, executable. Yeah. Well, originally, he just released the game for free for everybody. He's just like, all right. No, it's all no, no, Did he release it for free? I thought he always charged for it. Wasn't no, there was, like some free demos there was a out demo. there? Yeah, 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 there was a demo. Was a there demo. Was, yeah, but the full game. The, was, it wasn't the Yakuza was, 6. Yeah, Come was, on yeah, now, exactly. Jesus. <laughs> the whole thing was, I looked inside the EXE and literally Steam's one plugin is all that stops it from being completely bare bones and that can be done with 7-zip. Yeah. <laughs> you don't even need a hex editor. If you want to do the debug oh, stuff, um, yes you do. Great. You I remember how I played the game now. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Thank you, fool. I, I, I just like, remembered how I was able to play Delta Root the first time. I'm like, oh, right, I did that. That's how I played <laughs> Mighty Number no. 9. I, I remember like all this like dev shit, but then like back in the day, you you would put like a seat like a PlayStation One game on a CD, and you would get like secret music and shit. That was that was cool. The, oh, the fucking greatest this shit was a... uh, back in the day. Working Designs used to put their outtakes in on the uh, on the discs if you played them as a CD. I, I used to we... love hearing those outtakes. This is a I PlayStation think, as you 1 can black see, this is a PlayStation black disc. Cut number one contains computer data, so please don't play it. 
But you probably won't listen to me anyway, <laughs> will you? Do, 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 yeah, do, do, I love do, that. Do, do, do. I, man, that song should have been in the game. <laughs> uh, when I think of those kind of errors, my brain defaults to Skies of Arcadia's on the Dreamcast. Oh, really? How was like, that one? Hey, this is a Dreamcast disc. There is data on track one. We can't save the world from a Dreamcast from the CD player, so put us back in the Dreamcast so we can do our job. I just love <laughs> that line read at the end. It is so hummy. It's just... Mm. Mm, yes. I need to hear that. I need to hear that. Okay, fine. I, th I think my favorite Dreamcast bonus is the one that gave you malware. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kira Queen's also mentioning that in the chat. Uh, do, we, was, do, we, do we get a game for that? Game that, was that shit, name. Oh, I'm... I'm trying to remember what game it was, but I believe like the computers that they made the game on had a virus. It had and a virus. Oh, uh, and I slipped into the source code. Yeah. Well, yeah, shit, what is it? Let's see. It's in general. I know Guru Larry made a video of it, knowing him. Here we go. Dreamcast game spreads virus. It was Atelier. It was um Marie and Ellie. Atelier game, really? Yeah. The anime business sim. All right. <laughs> yeah. I was expecting something like a Western racing game or whatever, or an unlicensed thing, but. Really? Okay. Oh Which my god. Oh my god, experiment. It's so weird to hear all these voices. It's actually oh, talking no! out like this. <laughs> it's know. just funny though with this game because Atelier is still spreading malware through, you know, <laughs> downloading photos from <laughs> questionable websites. Hey, so so I just found out what made that especially bad. The game came with a screensaver you could only download by putting it in your computer. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. So, so people put the screen, put it in to get the screensaver and got infected with the virus. Uh, Trevor Maze, bring it up. If, uh, if you emulate it, will the ROM come with the virus? That's a good um, question. Well, no, if it's a GDI, then as far as the thing's concerned, it's on the Dreamcast disk drive, not a CD drive. Okay. Like, the ROM is fine, so long as you don't, I don't know, ex open it up in 7-zip or whatever and find yeah. the affected files. But at the same time, if you can find the affected files, you can just cure them i mean well, yeah because it's the virus from like what 99 you'd be surprised how many viruses from the dos era could still demolish a modern window yeah, you know what computer. they say the prototype is always stronger than the uh <laughs> that's the finished product so. <laughs> you know what i'm just not gonna download the game <laughs> <laughs> probably not like, good <laughs> i mean like you say that now i have every single dreamcast disc released sitting on an ssd he it's just like slowly looks over to it. It's like that one game's gonna fuck everything over one of these days. <laughs> they re-release it and it causes the Series X to blue screen. <laughs> <laughs> I'll turn that. I'll turn your X's into an actual. It's fridge. not in our database. It, it it goes back to ancient Mayan relic times. Experiment is sitting on a fucking bio weapon. <laughs> um, which one? Ah <laughs> uh, yes. Uh, Doomsday device. Or the, the weather. Creators. So, I, I found something out. The creators of the virus, they've all been dead for over 50 years! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? Oh no. I'm gonna drop the uh, article I was reading about this in the chat. Oh hey, the Dreamcast jumped killed. It's been a while. Seven tech. Oh, that <laughs> reminds me. That's a good um, segue. Did you hear what's happening with Norton and Avast? No, I did uh, not. No, I did not. They're finally merging together in an $8 billion deal, so now you can have two pieces of shit in Yay! one software. Oh, okay. Yay! No Man, I gotta fucking Look. uninstall Vast. Please do. We're All right, it's fine. The world finally uninstalled McAfee, we just have two left. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, McAfee had installed itself. <laughs> What's a good antivirus? Windows Defender? Malware bites? All yeah, it's like the basic ass Windows Defender that comes with your computer now is more than enough. Like, that's really all don't you need. Don't click any suspicious links! Well, that's just common I'm sense, though. Like, it's like, you don't need fucking virus protection to tell you that shit. Don't spend John? 79 to 89 99 a year just to say, hey, don't click on suspicious links. Well, gee, I couldn't just fucking save money and just not do that myself. Yeah, but, but old man, people are stupid. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Say, and you underestimate the stupidity of the human race. You yeah, forget that the man on Facebook told me to download it. <laughs> it's right, you you would be surprised how many calls that I've received where some old person has fallen for the scam of, oh, we can help you save fifty percent fifty percent off your direct TV bill. Just send us a five hundred dollar eBay gift card. Oh my what? god. How do people keep falling for that? 
They're old and stupid. Ah! It, it happens yeah, all the time. Right, yeah. Like, we can... We are now only able to sell one Apple gift card per customer because... Oh, cash only, by the so way. We've gotten so many of these scams at my Nicely work done. that, uh... Well, nice. uh I mean, I, I can talk from a personal experience. Like, they're, they're getting kind of nasty with them as well because they're also putting them on job listings and stuff like that. That's yeah. how I got scammed last year, unfortunately, yeah. on that. <sighs> the, that the, was, was finding all of those pickups from memory. Let's yeah, go. let us nice. go back to our ship and end this game. Yep. Yeah, I'm about yep. to say that GameStop is basically doing the same thing, too. It's like, hey, we can only sell you a certain number of cards that can only start, reach to a certain amount. If we sell you any more, our computers will just fucking stop you. Had an old lady who tried to come inside a store who wanted to buy $2,000 worth of uh, Steam uh, codes, or Steam uh, cards, and I'm like, hey, yeah, we can't do that for you, ma'am. Yeah. And she was making a hussy fit. And, she, and I'm like, ma'am, you're possibly getting scammed. And she basically handed me a phone, and guess who was on the other line? The was scammer. it perhaps a scammer? Mm-hmm. And that was it. And do you know what I did for her? I basically just talked to the dude and said, All right, so this is GameStop, and I just want to let you know, go fuck yourself, you piece of shit fucking person. <laughs> this person is trying her damnedest ah. to buy stuff like that. When I hang up the phone, she just looked at me, and I said, Ma'am, I just did you a favor. We, we had a real nasty case at my job a couple months ago where uh, a lady sent her phone in to get repaired at a place, and they wanted her to get 500 it was like a lot of money in fucking steam gift cards like i thought it was 500 but i i think i'm remembering wrong um no i think it was less than that the important part is uh there were the sale partially went through and then they figured out it was a scam after the fact getting so like, that money back is so difficult man mm -hmm. it really is i've had to do that oh yeah we have ice um, on skyrim hunter Yep, we okay, have so also I hate how long this freaking room takes to load. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, this is uh, this is Fonzie's tales from the from the old store that I worked at. Uh, yeah. So as a sales uh, as salesman, we were even if we know it was this, they were getting scammed. Uh, we were forced to just sell them as much as we can to make commission. Oh, that's so scummy. Well, if anything, you're not making any profit out of the cards because the cards are just basically digital items. You're just taking the money and basically yeah. laundering back to them because you only only get a certain amount of percentage. So it'd be in your yeah. best interest to stop that sort of shit. Yeah, I mean, the, the thing is, uh, the store at our store, you could have bought it with our in-store credit card. So oh. we would convince them to do that and they would get them in debt pretty much. Uh, so, so it all up. Uh, just as a heads up, since I'm I'm playing Metro Prime on Dolphin, this is the only time in the game the aspect ratio does its really fucky shit. Yeah. Uh, it only happens in this it's fight for some reason. Yo, it's my boy! So if you're wondering why the screen squishes every once in a while, that's just because yep. I'm emulating this on Dolphin. Yo, this Metal Ridley is um, fucking sick. This still happens in the trilogy version. Really? Yeah, on Dolphin. Ooh, that's, oh yeah, man, that it's been so changes. awesome. Yeah, I, I have... There you I, go. Yeah, there you go. Uh, I'll need to see if Antidote can give us an exact course of that, because we've tried to figure that shit out for years, and we've got nothing. You can't just force it to be uh, 4x3? It has Ooh, something to oh. do with the game Shaders. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, fucking Prime 2 is way worse with it. Like, I Prime, told 2, you guys Prime 2, I'm probably going to be playing off hardware, because I... I if, if I were you, just do yourself a favor and do it on a GameCube, a Wii, or even just a hacked Wii U. Yeah, because uh, I'm, not, I'm not dealing with Dolphin. Meta Ridley personally attacks your meta aspect ratio. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's very meta. This fight's great, though. I, I hated this fight uh, first time. Because I did not have every item getting here the first time. And it was the, uh, the second phase that fucked yeah. me as a kid. I'm so glad that this, this is his second skin in Smash Brothers. I'm so fucking happy yeah. about that. Yeah. Uh, I I always use the uh, for Smash. I always use the uh, Robo Ridley because uh, I really like the color scheme with the yeah. Meta Ridley design. For her. I just like it when he stands up with the metal outfit. <laughs> <laughs> it's like just, still one of my favorite what the fuck taunts. In Smash. I, yeah, I love that his taunt is just standing up. <laughs> You see, I always do it of just like if a person just fails to recover. Oh, you're doing, you're doing the trick? You're doing the trick? Yeah. Oh, shit. Got attack his ankles. Uh, uh, boost ball worry, shreds his health big time. Only works on 1.0, though, I think. Yep. It works on just GameCube versions yeah. only. It, 
it's approximately how you feel when something bangs into your ankle. To yeah. Get to <laughs> Ow! <Dude>. Fuck! <laughs> Sam has, has successfully weaponized hitting the scooter against your ankle. Oh god! <laughs> oh my god! It's basically that guilty gear move that I've been seeing yeah. for the. One oh, game. the, the oh. boss super. Yeah. <laughs> call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! But not for, but not me. for me! But not for me! <laughs> the last time I had a scam call with someone from, I would presume, Central Asia, trying to um, scam us on a PPI thing. And then he started threatening because I wasn't taking the bite. And I just went, dude, I have your number. And more importantly, I've been able to track where you are. You try and call me again, I will gouge your eyes out with a screwdriver. <laughs> I think my favorite scam calls is the one talking about my social security number. Yeah. Which is fun. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's pretty good. Yeah, so why is the scan dash really fucky with this fight? With the scan dash? I yeah, I, I I swear to Christ, I try to like dodge to the side when he's doing the little thing, and it, 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 it was oh, this thing's hitbox is just bloody ridiculous. Um, also, uh, when he dashes at you uh, near the end of it, it like you can't log on to him. And, yeah. Uh, I feel like it's just the timing. I notice that I've gotten a lot less scam calls since I moved, and I'm wondering if it's like if they did somehow were getting. I did not change my phone number. I... Huh. Yeah, it's very strange. Do you guys get those uh, spoofed scam calls where like it's basically your own number that's calling you with like yes, yep. yes. I actually had someone call me once, like ask like because they'd gotten a spoofed call from my number and like thought I was legitimately calling uh, them. It was like nothing I could do to help you about that one. Oh my it wasn't god, me. that, that well, would make a lot of sense to some interactions I've had. You know what's even Frank, what's even sure. worse? My car warranty. Mm -hmm. No, someone taking <laughs> control of your texts. <laughs> oh, Wait, what was that? One more time. Someone taking control of your texts. Oh, that's terrifying. Uh, so there's um, companies that you can use to do bulk messages. Um, so you can send you know just messages out in bulk to several phone numbers. Oh, I think I saw now, someone like use that to weaponize scammers. Now you can use that and you can register it with whatever number you want. So you can use someone else's phone number and carriers will just give that give that over. That's so fucked, it's fucked up. up. And they can look at all your texts that are uh, incoming and you won't even know. Holy shit. Oh man, they're going to see all my texts that I've been doing with Nathan and all the crazy photos <laughs> we've been sending to each I other. I mean, more importantly is they can see your fucking two-factor shit. Yep. Oh god, your you're right. Messages. Oh fuck, yeah, you're right. No, yeah, that's right. I got to take 5 minutes scary. for myself. I got to take a piss. And I don't feel like doing yeah. challenge pissing, so. <laughs> Coward! Two-factor isn't as secure as people think it is these days. Yep. Yeah. For the record, the mic is still hot, so you guys can keep talking. Yeah, okay. we're just... <laughs> just... So I'm trying to think, what was another bad call we got? Oh, right, that was a dude trying to sell his car insurance when I can't drive. And then he suddenly, when I wasn't taking the bike for that, I was like, do you want to fuck my daughter instead? It was just, wait, excuse me? <laughs> just, no. No, don't call again. That's you do not want me when I'm angry. Hello, we're talking about your car extended warranty. Ah, oh, cool. Yeah, my car's warranty is uh, expired. Yeah, oh, yeah, I what year is it? It's a 1985 Honda Civic. Yeah, oh. I normally I've used and to get scam calls for uh, PPI car insurance, which I didn't have, or it was from a, micro a so-called Microsoft thing. I love those, and just running on a virtual machine. Uh, one Man. of my favorite ones I did once was I ran three Windows 3.1 in the VM. That was a great <laughs> two hours. It's so nice to fuck over scammers. <laughs> I think the funniest uh, one I ever did was, um, oh, I'm not sure. This one looks different from normal Windows. I think it might be an old version of Mac. I was running Amiga Workbench 1.3 from 1984. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, can I connect to your PC? Sure. <laughs> yeah, all you hear is just like a random boot up noise. It's from like the uh, Windows 98. <laughs> I, I love the Windows 95 fucking boot up. Ugh. I love 95s. I love 98s as well. 98s sounds like wants to try and take your breath away. Oh, uh, I can't wait for the new fucking multi game. I'm so excited. 
They got the I... voice of the. They got the voice of Toru from Dragon Maid as uh one of the maids, and I'm so excited excited for that. Wait, oh, wait, 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 wait. What game y'all talking about? Melty Blood. Melty Blood. I'm yeah. excited. Uh, Melty Blood. It's a yeah. anime fighting game from like the. 2000s. Okay, I'm done. Goodbye. Yo, yeah. who's ready to? <laughs> who's ready for the Melty Blood tournament in the hallway? Let's go. Hell yeah. in, the in the hall, in the hallway, you mean in the toilet, my friend? Yeah, it's <laughs> yeah. the bathroom. It's a true melting You're right. Experience. You're right. <laughs> okay, so speak. All right. Uh, so I have a pretty decent Android tablet. I found that I can run RetroArch. I found that I can run like Naomi stuff. So I was playing Melty Blood Act Condensa on the toilet a couple days like last <laughs> night with the fight stick. Hell yeah! I'm, I'm oh, so. In the bathroom? Have you gotten the um, a Thomas Wave on there? Yeah. Nice. Dude, I am so mad my fucking new fight stick does not work on this computer. I've been having to... I've been using controllers on everything, and it fucking sucks. <laughs> I, 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 I bought... I bought this... I bought a... A Hori Real Arcade Pro, like... Evo 2015, so... And it still works fine. So I, I do have a Hori one that I keep in a box, because it's, it's the fucking massive uh, MVC3 Oof. one. Oh, and, okay. And I'm wondering if like if that would work. It should. It, might. it should. Yeah. Uh, I I forget what the uh, name is, but n normally, uh, if you guys can maybe help me like identify what it was, because I I don't think the brand name is on there anymore. But it's like this uh, yellow and black fight stick that's like got a honeycomb kind of design on it. Uh, can you remember the name of it? Uh, I, I, I think I know which one you're talking about. Cause I, that, I think that's the one I've got. The uh, yeah, that's the one. Yeah, the, yeah the that's the one drum. I normally uh, use whenever I use a fight stick. That, that's the one I've been trying to use, and it's just not working. Hmm. Yeah. I, I, ha I have a. Well, my fight stick is also modified. I changed the gates to be different depending on the game I play. Mm. Okay. I if it's guilty gear, I. If it's Guilty Gear, I sit to a square gate, something with Blaze Blue. Street Fighter, I play with octagonal gate because I got used to American controls. Ugh. I seriously need to get a Dreamcast arcade stick and just modify that thing for USB. Uh, what am I missing? How many um, are we missing? Uh, here you go. Yeah, we're missing a number of them. Because let me think there's Lumigex, there's the Fish and Metroids, two phases of Metroid Prime. Uh, we got the Aqua Drone already, Fish and yeah, Metroid. Yeah, look uh, at the uh, Discord chat. Hold on. If you ever get a chance. Thank you, John. For everyone else. I mean, John, too. <laughs> I mean, yeah, definitely should take a look at later. Jesus. No, now, because I'm ordering <laughs> now. Uh oh, yeah. yeah I, that. Scanned, uh, I scanned uh, oh, Mega Pirate. All right, hold on a second. Hey, All right, so two forms of Metroid is. Prime and Fission Metroid, that's three. Let's yep. count how Lumi many. Gek. One, two, three. Three. John, what burger you want? Uh, well, there's bacon uh, cheeseburger. There are three. four. Basic. Yeah, that's perfect. No, wait, there are four that I'm missing? What am I missing? You're missing the Lumigex, which are in the next room. Okay. The Fish and Metroids, that's in the room after. And then oh, both okay, final. yeah. I, I completely forgot about the, the, the fucking phase on scorpions. Little things. Yeah. Little exorbital things that are just in this one room and nowhere else. It's a shame. They're pretty cute for radioactive that's things, That's weird. I mean, what's weirder is this Phazon type that shows up here and nowhere else. Nowhere else, yeah. It's like advanced Phazon. You right. never see it again. No. The fact, the fact that it's gold, I started calling it Super Phazon. I saw uh, someone did a modded version of this that changes all of this to Blue Phazon, and it looks way better. Yeah, it probably does if you give it a proper makeover. You did scan the fish in Metroid. Wow! Impact that... Freedom. That Metroid had no chance when it got close to you. But we <laughs> have all the power bombs, so like that's uh, how we're going to be taking care of them. Did you scan um, the fucker? Yeah, I did. Okay. okay well, there's a missile station in there if you need it. Yeah, yeah. I uh, have I told you guys about the Arby's incident? I don't what? The Arby's incident? The incident? You gotta follow up with a year after that. Uh, like the Arby's incident of 1987 or some other shit. My birth year. <laughs> the bite of eighty seven. Yeah, uh, I was thinking more about, about my birth. I was thinking more about my birth year, but <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> but uh, um, it would have been like 2017, 2018. Oh, go right ahead. Uh, so that was back whenever I was still working at a uh, at Dollar General, and um, there's this this just almost I guess she was about eighteen and she was working at Arby's, and she came in and she was like buying off uh green dot cards with a bunch of cash 
And then I finally noticed that uh, she had a deposit slip that they would have used for RVs because it was pretty similar to ours. And I noticed that she was using, you know, the money from the deposit slip. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Saying that her manager uh, had said to to move the money over to cards because it'd be more secure for whenever they come by. And so I just kept running it as a um, as like EBT cash, so it wouldn't go through. I like and that um, eventually, whenever I had a chance and went on break, I went ahead and you know like called up uh, one of the local Arby's and asked for like their their district manager. Well, it turns out they basically shut down the store, was giving money to scammers. <laughs> Who oh. they thought was their like district manager, apparently, oh. and uh, oh. eventually that girl had got like five years in prison. Oh, boy. holy oh. shit! Damn, that bad. uh, that kind of ha- all right. So when I used to work at a uh, at Cricket, uh, we used to get we actually get warnings about like, hey, if this guy calls you and he asks you for money at the register and he says one of our names, don't give it to him unless you confirm it with us first. Because apparently our store, like one uh, one of the stores that like one of our sister stores. I actually got hit with like a scam like that. Busting, be busting, busting, busting. It just really sucks that she fell for something like that and now is having to suffer for it. Yeah. I mean, fuck Especially, that, that they got the money happens. back. Yeah. That kind of shit happens all the time in retail though. Like, a guy at my job just got fired because uh, he got caught in a fucking police sting uh, underage alcohol sales thing. Whoa. Oh good lord. Uh, okay, at least it was at least it was alcohol sales. That's wholesome. Yeah, th- I I was afraid that was gonna go another direction. <laughs> no, it was like it literally like he fucking didn't ID someone right. The cops were right there and they fucking got him instantly. It would everyone was real pissed off when they found out. I mean, yeah. once, when the pandemic started, uh, there was a lot of incidents of just like young people just dressing up like older, just buying like liquor and shit like that. Yeah. Well, I had a very simple way of dealing with that because, I mean, during the entire time, of course, that I was working at Dollar General, I was under 21, and I'd ask them, "It's like, well, would you card me if I tried buying alcohol from you?" No. Well, good. You'd be in jail right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's why I card. Oh boy, I don't care if you look like Taylor. The only time I'm gonna be using the ice spreader. Hey, the The one time. The one time we use it. (laughs) Yep. I mean, hey, it's more times than the fucking flame for us. Yeah. Uh, continue on, Jason. I'm sorry for interrupting. I I had to mention that. (laughs) I know. I was just saying. Is like, yeah, I'll card you even if you look like my grandfather. (laughs) Yeah. No, everybody's gotten super paranoid since this happened a couple weeks ago. Now we're everybody's carding everything. Like, no exceptions. I had a cop come in last night who was like, was like he was about 60 years old, carded him for his fucking Nicorette. Like, not even for booze. Oh. Hey, better safe than sorry. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean. Yeah. No, I don't feel like he's a playing Uh, that was an attempt. It's about the I guess thing you can say about that weapon. The worst incident I had was where a guy was just getting really, really upset about me carding him. And because he didn't have his card on hand. Mm-hmm. And um, he's like, well, I'll just walk out of here with it. All right, bye. And I just glance behind him, and he notices me doing that. And he looks behind him, really big, tall dude, clearly in shape. I'm like, you know who that is, right? No. He's the undercover cop for this neighborhood. Yeah. Do you really want to do that? <laughs> That's been Diesel, motherfucker. <laughs> that is fucking awesome. Which, that dude was always fun. He uh, dressed up as a stripper cop for Halloween. (laughs) (laughs) For this Uh, night, I will go as myself. 18 plus only, though. (laughs) What the fuck? I'm pretty sure it's fine if we're talking about, like, carding things. So, like, when I was... Alright, so, in high school, I got really lucky and got a full beard and mustache. So I was able to go to bars really early. (laughs) Really? That's all it took? They didn't card you? No. <laughs> Bro, I, I, I was 17 and Fonz? I looked like a- I'm Guy Incognito. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> no, the it, best part is I could just I could just talk Spanish and just pretend I'm a foreigner and it was fine. <laughs> oh my god. Oh fuck you. Uh, but I, I didn't go drinking. I literally just went to the barcades here in Vegas and that's all I did. <laughs> oh hell yeah, you got arcade? Yeah, I'm totally 18. Let's fucking yeah, go. Let's <laughs> <laughs> To be fair, Fonzie, yeah, if, I'm five if, foot thirteen. Would, <laughs> I would totally fucking do the same thing too. If it was just to go play arcades, it's like, yeah, I don't want anything to drink. Yeah, I'll just take some water. I just want to play some arcades. <laughs> Hello, yes, I uh, I am from Spain. Uh, no, see, yes, 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 yes. Uh, I am Ben Ben Duno, yes. And then just they're like, oh, okay, whatever. You sound whatever. You, you have a, you have wow. a full, you have a full goat teeth, and again, like you're fine. You're fine. Oh, we're out of mess. Meanwhile, I'm, yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna be fucking carded for the entire rest of my life. I can feel it. I got oh. carded for the first time in like a decade, maybe two weeks ago. Hey, I, well. I, w I was at work the other night, and one of the new girls who's like 18 um, asked me how old I was. It's like, I'm 26. And she was like, oh, I thought you were like 19. It's like, no. Uh, if only. <laughs> I, more of uh, uh, my older sister uh, came back a little while ago, and I was just laughing because we we were going out for uh, drinks as a family kind of deal, and she was the only one that got carded. I'm two years younger than her and didn't get carded at all during that wow. time. It's <laughs> the beard, man. It's I'm beard. only yeah, it's the beard. I'm gonna say it's the beard. Only... To me, it, it helps that I have a beard and my bald head. Yeah. Well, for me, it's the beard as well. But even before then. So, I'm only 24, and outside of, you know, Walmart, because of how their uh, self-checkout works, I've only been carded, like, twice in the last five years. Man. I didn't uh, get carded the last time I went to Sherlock, which was, like, shocking. It's like, I'm pretty sure, well, I'm pretty sure I'm older than the people working the registers. Y'all are too young to not be carding people. Yeah. I have never been carved yet. <laughs> I don't know if it counts though, but like the the cannabis dispensaries over here, they're well, you're always forced to enter, and then you're supposed to put your ID like in a little machine to scan it. What the yeah. shit? That was really fast. I could tell Blinken he was on the other side of the Yeah, yeah. Time. I was like, wait a minute, this is the south side. I don't like this part. <laughs> I'm gonna get mugged here. <laughs> Back to north for me. <laughs> Hey, Metroid, are you gonna die? Yeah. <laughs> Color coded for your convenience. There we go. I just, for some reason, love the full animation. Just, I'm gonna get that. Wait, wait. I love how the model itself went through that little floor that's like right here where Samus is right now. Oh, no. Daniel. Alright, so Daniel. this is like the moment of truth. I always get nervous here when I'm doing 100% scan runs because Metroid Prime Phase 2 should be the final scan. Sure. But not. I was like 17 when we went to Cracker Barrel one time, and this old lady thought that uh, my sister was my daughter. I was like, oh. what? Oh. It's only a five year difference, what? Oh! <laughs> no, you know what they say. No, no, Make them no, young. No, 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 no. That is not hey. what they say, John. No. <laughs> no! That was a wrong nutty type. Yeah, that was very good timing. <laughs> Make them look at 12? <laughs> like, what? Excellent timing. It's like a five year difference, nut, nut, nut. <laughs> Sweet home. I'm coming home to you. I'm coming. <laughs> um, oh. Yes, chats, we have absolutely everything now. Sweet home of a Ooh, werewolves of London. I don't know how to do the hi prolonged hyper thing, so I'm just gonna yeah, like, like, step into like the goop lot. Yeah, you have to sort of like go in out, in out, in out. Uh, and keep shooting. That's stupid. You're yeah, it's how to... able to get like half or half its health down. So can we talk about doing. Metro Prime Phase 2's AI? Like what the hell causes him to just drop the puddle? Because sometimes he can he can go for minutes without doing shit. I've it's tried random. looking at the code based on the reverse engineered version of this game and um holy shit is it a mess. <laughs> like Antidote wasn't joking to me when he said this was spag bowl code. So is Metro Prime uh, is Dark Samus? Yes. Not yet. Uh, okay. in a bit, she will be. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, if you just like, like if you like stutter step in between like the ground and the phase on, you should be able to like spam it nonstop. If it was just poke the edge of the puzzle. No. You hey, know what? what I would love for lore for Metroid Prime 4? What's that? What's that? Uh, that this isn't actually Metroid Prime. <laughs> The Metro probably the first long way along the way. No, just have it be an X parasite. Oh, so like, are you going off like at the ending of this game? Yeah, that would be amazing. <laughs> and that's hey. the reason why it turns into Dark Samus. Yeah. Hey, can we talk about how Metroid Prime just in both forms has human faces? Because I don't yeah, like that's, that. That's really weird. Well, I just love the camera shaking like ah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, at me. Prime, why do you have teeth? Yeah. <laughs> I love how big its eyes get when it's taking damage. Yeah. It's just like, oh fuck! It's like it's like it put a, <laughs> put a tentacle in an electrical outlet. Why does the Metroid Prime just run away from Samus? Oh, because it's, it's probably they want the suit. Super, <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, I want that suit. <laughs> Give me the suit. Territorial Metroids yeah, are not you gonna you fucking give up. Wait a minute, that's not the phase on suit, that's that lame ass zero suit or uh fusion suit. You aren't even supposed to know what that means, Jack! Give it back. Where's my Chozo I think suit? You're a time travel in Metroid, hold up! Oh Jason, that'll be perfect when we're on zero mission. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my power suit? Giant creepy statue, what is my fully powered power suit? Where's my gravity suit? <laughs> oh my god. Why do you need to know? I need is that the Chozo talking back? Yeah. <laughs> okay. No, no, it's the mirror. It just turns out to be a really ancient answering machine. Oh they just, fuck. Fuck. just take a shit! Alright. Okay. Right, just don't, Thank I you. just can't do it when you're looking. <laughs> Alright, Bondi, let up smash. We're gonna be shitting for a while. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, for fuck's sake. Is, is this the true challenge pissing? We've come all this way. I mean, Linky, do you want to tell the story about the shitting streak that I had? Oh, yeah, where we're basically oh. playing Smash Brothers oh, and you're at the oh fucking toilet. Just, just oh, legitimately. Get, get out of my puddle. So we, were playing, so we were playing Smash oh, Ultimate, I think it was like, what, like week three when it came out or something like yeah, that? Yeah, it was like week three. It, it was really early, and then like, Linky was just having fun, and I'm like, I hop in, I'm like, alright, cool. I was like, king of the hill for a while. And then I finally got taken down, and all you hear is me flushing the toilet. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker was on the toilet, just winning matches. <laughs> when, you take a shit, when you take a shit on someone's ego, figuratively and literally. <laughs> I always, I always imagine when uh, Samus goes into uh, the phase on puddle, just basically just the equivalent of these edibles say like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Look, this, the Switch is a portable console, I'm gonna use it as a portable console, right? <laughs> I must be going through this thing tonight, it's like, why the fuck am I weak to my own drug? Uh, <laughs> why is everything weak to its own drug? No, it's like uh, Metal Man with Metal Blades Mega, Mega, uh, Actually, Mega Man 2. Hold on. Never if, double if, in your own supply. If if, if that's the the Cetibles ain't shit, what, what's the face on pool in Metroid Prime <laughs> Three? <laughs> the Flintstones. <laughs> the Flintstones <laughs> vitamins. I mean, considering by that point, it's just like a little face forms in the face, but it's just like, yeah, it's eleven. What if we got lost? Nah. Why why does a Metroid just make those weird faces? I just. I mean, why does a Metroid have a face? Why do you magic have magic? Must defeat magic. I was about to make that joke, god damn it. <laughs> magic must defeat magic. God, I, I miss Jackie. Right, I wanna go back to watch Jackie Chan's adventures. <laughs> What's stopping you? Uh life. Lazy. What's damn. it available on right now? That's a good question. It's What's it not. on Netflix not too long ago? That's a good question, Mega Man. That's fine. Hey. That's a good question, Mega Man. You must uh, you must have the rest run to Huawei. It's a Corax. This should bring back that voice actor from Mega Man, just for shits and giggles. Have it be what? like Wait, hold on, why is it brown now? What? Yeah. <laughs> uh, lighting. It's an ex-parasite. <laughs> bad touch, bad touch, bad touch, bad touch! No, this is my suit! Oh, uh, wait, uh, I actually like purple. Nah, this is fine, you can have it. Oh, wait, that's gonna go blue. Uh, <laughs> uh, big. Did you just steal my soul? <laughs> 
My epidermis. I need that. <laughs> oh, yeah, this Slap is the Sunny D off of me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, time for good old JPEG. He, he took my Sunny D suit. Now I'm purple drink. <laughs> As you do. The you know white. what? Unsplats your neck. <laughs> <laughs> so why did yeah. this place blow up after that? I'm, I'm really glad Samus' suit is just like the Batwing. Well, time uh, for Uncanny Valley face number one. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Oh my oh, god, no. it's, it's so fucking bulky. <laughs> I feel like her face here being Whoa, like that... her face is in the other two <laughs> games. Suit with that face that doesn't <laughs> look right at all. <laughs> yeah. It looks like her head is way smaller than it should be for the rest of her body. Oh, they should have got <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna put my other suit back on. I do find it funny that Prime of all the games I think is like the least you get for the 100% in terms yeah. of like the end screen kind of deal. God, my butt looks good, but I have no There's neck. One final kind of thing Skip left to do if he wants to do it, which is we could scroll the credits and skip the whole thing. Yeah, that's true. Through the power of the analog stick. <laughs> the Yay! Steve Barcia. Yes, well, quite yes, look at all these people well, 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 spent hundreds well. and thousands of hours trying to get this game done. Mm, yes, very appreciative. We all appreciate your hard work, but that's nice, but you know, time and place, we gotta go, you know. We, we appreciate you, but we know you're not gonna make any money anyway. Mm. Heavily interlaced MP2. MP2. <laughs> we. Are we gonna watch the post credits scene? Of course we have, it's 100%. Wait a minute, why is there a planet blowing up? Yeah, let's see the final no, 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 Samus, are you okay? No, yeah, I'm trying to kill the fly. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, got away again. Wait, you know who? what she looks like? She looks like a slightly off-model The Boss. Yeah. <laughs> oh, a little bit. This is The Boss for, like, Square Enix's Marvel <laughs> The Avengers. Listen. They got The Boss's so stunt double. It's gonna get so much worse for Prime 2 and 3 where they try to make her look like Zero Suit Samus. Uh, <laughs> Prime 3, they kind of got uh, more but I, Prime 2. I live on no. through this <laughs> arm! <laughs> <laughs> I can see everything through this arm. Oh god, that's your dick. <laughs> oh, you remember to save at the end this time. Yeah, I, I didn't do that at the end of uh, United. I do want to find it really creepy of like the eyeball in the hand kind of deal. I wish she kept the eyeball in the hand. Yeah, no, it yeah. just becomes like hey, it just honestly. becomes like a glowing circle. It's not the same. Not the same. Not She's the gotta same be Resident all. Evil boss. Yeah. No, she has to do like the whole pants labyrinth thing of holding <laughs> the hands over their face. Oh, wait, we haven't done true 100. percent We haven't done the NES game on this. Yeah, oh, wait, okay. Yeah. Sure. Count. What we gotta do? Like engage with the motherfucker and break the. No, no, Narpa's sword. Yeah. No, oh no, that's the debug one though. Why would we do that? Oh, fair. I wonder what'll happen if you do uh, engage with the motherfucker. No, 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 you're not. You're not done. I see that seventy-five percent. Get that shit done. <laughs> uh, that's Linky's safe file. Uh, all right, let's, let's see. Not anymore. Uh, let's see what happens. I finished that game not so long ago, so technically it's hundred percent. Press L to quit. L. Mother, what? I, I still love Mother Brain fucking toast, by the way. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay, I haven't heard that one before. Expert, like, can you explain brain that? Fucking you explain toast? That? Uh, mother brain fucking toast has a unique password in that it kill mothers. It kills mother brain before you can even get to it. But when you get the credits, you will automatically get the worst ending because, as far as the game concerned, oh. you've taken over three hundred years to beat it. You won <laughs> yeah. by doing literally nothing. <laughs> we just got there. Uh -oh. At the end, we were She's all already dead. All <laughs> I, I can't believe we the ended her. <laughs> I love showing that off during Metroid United. <laughs> oh, nothing. It just takes us back to the tower screen. Yeah, it detects a CPU crash and doesn't also reboot in the Aww. emulator. Aww. Alright, Justin Bailey code it is. 
I remember trying it on my 3DS and- Oh no, sorry, uh, Switch, and it just uh, crashed the app. I'll, uh, get the spelling of it if you, if you really want to use it. Yeah, yeah, can we? Oh, it has to be spelled in a specific way? Yep. Okay. Because it requires Mother? a misspell. Mother? Mother? Mother! Mother! Don't you- Don't you don't worry about the combat, boy. What you say, what you say, mother. I don't want to- uh, Where is it? Uh, not Dragon Ball Z. Engage with the motherfucker. No, that's the fixed version of it that works. If you do engage Ridley motherfucker with a seven and a J, you get a workable password. I'm not surprised. I, I there's got to be so many passwords to this generator. Oh, there is uh, countless. Not here we go. I found it. I'll just copy paste it. So. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. Careless whispers. Let's go. I can't wait for you know like Metroid Seventeen, where we have sexy milf uh, mother brain and she's called Big Mama. No. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. I don't want Big Mama. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. You only see her for like what, forty-five minutes? Yeah, and then she takes like <laughs> she gets stabbed and wants <laughs> to bang her child. Hey, yep. uh, yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> Thank you. So, why does she have a thing for Snake when she knows it's her son? It's even worse wait, does she? I thought she was. I thought she was hallucinating Big Boss. I mean, she was, but still, at the same time, it's pretty. <laughs> I don't know, that's very Emmerich of you, ma'am. <laughs> God. So we should be in Torian with Ito. Yep, it worked. Now the question is, can you get through in one piece? Yeah, because I only have fucking 30 units of health. 30 units of health, 156 missiles, and um, not much else. Do you have save states? No. No, because this is a... Uh... Yes, we do. We're on Dolphin. Yes, we do. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 we yeah, do. Technically, we do. Yeah, because yeah, I'm about to say, if I could beat fucking Bowser in the proxy, I bet you can do this. <laughs> this is weird. Uh, I, the fucking controls are like original NES, and it's like, uh, this is weird on GameCube. Oh, yeah, because it's like, because it's like, they switched uh, A and B, right? Yeah. I mean, A and B are exactly the same, it's just that one's bigger than the other. <laughs> Look at that big old A button sitting right there in the center. I'm mandatory hitting 3, 2, 1. Fuck you, game. I hate that shit. Been ring it, dinker rings it, <laughs> fuck these things. Wait, you don't get the. Oh, long you beam. don't. Ooh. What? You don't have long beam. Nope. I don't. I won't. Need, yeah, I won't need it. No, you don't need it. We won't need it. We got the short end of the cock. <laughs> I mean, hell, when I did the um, long play of the Famicom Disc version of this, I just skipped killing all these things. It was just funny to walk on them, just to hear their weird fucking noises. As you walk on them? Yeah, I'll just touch them. They make noises that sound like it's emphasized that it was being choked to death. Next time is Zero Mission. Uh, are you not looking at the stream, good sirs and ladies? This is Betray Prime Zero Mission right now. It might look yeah, a little basic. Yeah. But, you know. a little, it's a little weird. Wow, why are the Rinkas spawning right there? They always do that? Uh, maybe? Yeah, I don't remember. Maybe a good, remember. good place to grind that health right there. No, not there, because they give pitiful fucking drops. Mmm, donuts. It's, uh, I've only mm. done the original Metroid maybe four times. One was Metroid Fusion, one was Practice. One was another practice, and one was for the Let's Play. Nah, I'm probably not going to go back anytime soon. I'm pretty sure they're not supposed to spawn there. I don't remember Rinkas ambushing me like this. Their, their names are Rinkas? Yeah, they call them Rinkas. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Well, that's fair. No, 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 no. Samus, you okay there? Oh, okay. Right, everybody remember that. Say, say, yeah, no. Oh, well. <laughs> I gotta call it. Uh, I gotta call it a wrap anyway because I gotta get ready for prog soon. Uh, we, you still probably gonna nail night? Yeah. No, we're done nails. It's just the uh, we need to get just get to Bahamut because it's need to actually f fucking practice the other phases. <laughs> That's the issue. Uh, okay, that's the end of Metroid Prime for the Metroid 35th anniversary celebration. So next uh, next week, starting next Tuesday, we're going to start Zero Mission. I thought that uh, was end of Evangelion. No, no, not at all. It's, it's, not, it's an entirely different thing. 
Uh, we're going to start Zero Mission next Tuesday. Tomorrow for Subnight, uh, we're going to have our Twitch sub Q&A. So we're just going to get the questions ready when I ask to put them inside the community channel. And we'll just have a, we'll shoot the shit for a couple of hours and then call it a night. Uh, oh, shit. Uh, Apple messaged me. Oh, okay. That's cool. My favorite Kill. character from End of Evangelion is obviously Robin Williams. Uh, speaking of that, let's, let's raid a small channel playing Metroid Zero Mission. Since I was about to say, we can't raid Robin. <laughs> That's kind of not possible right now, unfortunately. Uh, let us raid... Before we go, do you think he'd actually do something like that? If he was still around? I don't know. Robin Williams becoming a VTuber. I can see it. I think he'd be down for that. Oh, we can... I can see Disney paying him. This dude. Why not? Make sure he's not in folly only mood. Oh, it would would let me know that, at the very least. We need a raid hashtag, not challenge pissing. (laughs) (laughs) Hmm, Well, I don't, I don't... We talked a lot of challenge pissing all day. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, just ban my face. Just ban the Mimo face, when in doubt. Engage, really? (laughs) Just my Mimo face. All right, guys, I'll see you tomorrow for the Twitch sub Q&A. We're going to be doing that uh, starting 5 p.m. EDT. I'll put an update in the uh, Discord in case I forget. All right, guys, have a good night. Take care.